Hey everyone, welcome to the stream. How are you all doing today? All right, there we go. Image has popped up, so we are all set. Um, Ghost, I am doing great. Uh, the event later, I would like to join. I'll see if I have time for that. Uh, yeah, between this stream and work, it's been kind of a crazy day. Um, Lacey, my day has been pretty good overall. A uh, little bit tricky. I've been trying to basically get together a private server for Atlas, and that's been not going so well. It seems like there's some bugs with the system I chose. So, um, at the moment, having a few issues, but back on the official server and kind of getting everything together, I think we're almost ready to leave the Freeport, which is going to be amazing because I'm tired of being here. I can't tame anything in the Freeport area. Serenity Murphy, no, this is not Arc Mobile. This is actually what we call Atlas. Um, it's a new game by the people who made Arc on PC, uh, or many of the same people, technically a different company. So it is a pretty great game. I'm having a lot of fun. It just came out in early access a few days ago, and so, um, yeah, I kind of wanted to play it on the channel. <laughs> Uh, Axel, thank you so much for the congrats on the 20k. I'm super excited about it. We're actually already over halfway to 21,000. Like, I can't believe how fast this channel grows. So, I'm, I'm super excited about how well it's gonna go. Oh my goodness. Um, how do you get it? Renee, you can actually get this particular game by going into Steam and getting it that way. Uh... Andrea, I do remember you. I do. All right. Um, Flip, I think it's probably... Uh, it might be YouTube. YouTube has been having some trouble with um, the live streaming stuff lately, so the these name being the same as yesterday might be uh, part of that. So... I do apologize if everything looks the same as yesterday. It is not the same, I do promise, but um, I had it all edited and I don't know why YouTube is kind of being a butt about it. Uh, it's been it's been tricky trying to get everything sorted out for this. All right, I think I finally have enough of those orange food berries to keep going. Uh, my main goal is basically to just get out of the Freeport because the Freeport's terrible. There's too many people. And yeah, it's been, it's been a huge pain trying to actually get uh, all the stuff together because my raft disappeared and people keep taking things out of my boxes because even though it's PVE, there's a lot of bugs with uh, how you can access things. So it's kind of a problem. Um, Tristan, the live went offline. You'll need to refresh the page. That does happen sometimes. Uh, Andrea says, in Ark you made your saber tooth named Diego for me? Oh, yeah, I did. Oh my gosh, that was a long time ago, Andrea. Or Andrea. Um, is it on PC? Alex KK, yes, this is on PC. <laughs> um, let's see. Tame a pig one. Uh, Dino Fury, we will actually probably have to do that now that you've mentioned it, because that actually sounds pretty funny. I think that would be amazing. All right, let's go ahead and get some of this stuff set up. We're getting mostly okay in terms of food items. I think we have a few more things that we're probably going to need. Uh, we're going to need more wood for sure. Yeah, we're definitely going to need more wood. I'm going to go ahead and put away some of these items that I've collected just to make sure we've got as much stuff as possible. I'm going to make this the sap chest. I feel like I get way too much sap for what I need. Like, so much sap, and I don't need even half of that. Um, ooh, the shell resource is going to be good. Uh, PvP is hard for me. Righty, Mighty Reflex, PvP is only difficult to record. Uh, it's not that I have a problem playing PvP. It's just that it's very difficult as a content creator because... Uh, PvP often ends up with, um, I don't know how to put it. Basically, if you get knocked out, that can be, that can be a big problem, uh, for playing the game, actually, and for creating content. 
Uh, Trolley, thank you so much for the super chat. It says, what are you doing? Just joined. Um, Trolley, I am basically just hanging out, trying to get some stuff together. I think I need more wood, so I think I'm going to chop down these trees over here. Pick up a couple of stones while I'm at it. Uh, we almost have enough supplies to try to f sail ourselves out of the Freeport zone. I think I have enough food. I just need to stock up on some other materials, get some water, and then we should be able to leave and hopefully go to a lawless region. And in the lawless region, you can claim territory. You can tame creatures. Like, it's going to be a lot better once we get into a lawless region. I think I missed a notification there somewhere. Uh, Samuel Ibarra, thank you so much for subbing. And welcome to the channel. I knew I missed something. Uh, yeah, Ghost. I'm not surprised if the stream has the wrong thumbnail and title. That is YouTube being cranky. It reset all of my live stream stuff, which is why slow mode was off briefly. Um, and now it's created all sorts of issues. But, uh, this is gameplay 2. It is gameplay 2, I promise. <laughs> uh, Omega says, do you like Ark better or Atlas? Um, I still like Ark better because I'm a big dino fan. And, well, Ark is, Ark is kind of my main game. But Atlas is pretty good, and it has a lot of potential if they could iron out a bunch of streams. Uh, not a bunch of streams, a bunch of bugs. I think it would be a very, very good game. I'm having a lot of fun with it so far, in spite of the bugs, which uh, I think bodes pretty well for how it's going to do. Um, K. Ron says, is this game like Ark? Uh, it has a lot of the same mechanics as Ark, but it is not exactly the same as Ark. And D-Beast, uh, I actually have been playing ARK a lot. I actually released a video on ARK Mobile last night. Um, I haven't been on PC ARK for a while, but that's because Atlas just came out and I have limited amounts of time that I can actually be on and streaming. So hopefully I'll get back into Extinction soon. I just wanted to kind of get somewhere on Atlas uh, before I go back to Extinction. And eventually Scorched Earth. I want to get back into Scorched Earth. Uh, Jonathan Angel, hello. Welcome. <laughs> Emanuela says, what's the name of the game? The game is called Atlas. It's pretty great. Hey, Chase, welcome. Um, <laughs> Let's see. What's my favorite animal in ARC? Favorite animal in ARC definitely gotta be the Iguanodon. Although I do love the rock drakes from Aberration. Uh, Yellow, you've been noticed, and yes, awesome, you've got a boat ready, I cannot wait to go on that ride with you. Uh, Jesse, hello, yes, welcome, I do remember you. I always remember that channel name, and then, thank you for telling me what it's supposed to be, I'll try to remember for today. Uh, Flip, yes, I will absolutely join you in killing all the sabers you can find, it is not okay that they, uh, killed everything. Alright, I need more vitamin D. I probably need to eat more of these veggies and things. I gotta, like, balance out my stuff real quick. Alright, uh, those and more veggies. I need to eat more veggies. Oh my gosh. Balancing the vitamins is really tricky. Uh, Exotic Clutches, thank you so much for subbing. Welcome to the channel. Uh, Sam, hey, welcome. <laughs> Eric, uh, Jones, yes, I do remember you from the last time I streamed, actually. Rad, you've been noticed, and thank you so much for saying all that. That is appreciated. Blue Chameleon says, hi, Gwen, I wish you a great stream. Can I tame a griffin without a crown? Yes, you can if you are levels 85 to 95. Uh, the higher the level, the higher level griffin you'll be able to tame. Or if you share the same, like, I think they call it the last name, but it's actually, like, the last few letters of your name with the griffins. For example, um, as Iguana, I can tame any griffin with the last name ending, with the name ending in N-A at level 40. All right, let's get out of here. Eh, can I get up? Up. There we go. And can I also repair my raft? Uh, there we go. Repair! I don't like that it keeps breaking on me. Okay, I think... 
I think we have most of the stuff that we need. There is, um, I'll just cook that real quick. Got a lot of wood. Should be okay on campfires and such. Got a lot of hide. We should be okay there. Um, plenty of thatch. Plenty of berries. Plenty of meat. I think we've got most everything we need. Um... <laughs> Let's see, let's see. <laughs> uh, Red says, I see uh, your griffin on the PVX. Oh, awesome. Uh, yeah, I think that's probably Rutrine's griffin. I haven't gotten very far on PVX yet. I'm still in like the low, I think I'm like level 30 now, but uh, still have a lot of ways to go. Eric Jones, I have seen the Tigron Atlas. I spawned in in a random area when I was kind of just uh, getting familiar with the controls of the game. And that actually... <laughs> I got killed by a tiger, which was pretty great, but uh, definitely terrifying. So I, I am familiar with it. I have been, have definitely encountered those. All right. I think I want to make a couple more spears or at least one. And guys, I think we just need to maybe fish, but we might be okay without fishing. Um, we definitely need to get some water refills, and I think once we get some water and some fish, we should be all good to go. Yeah, Nacho, the goal is to tame a chicken today. Like, my whole goal is to tame a chicken. Unfortunately, to tame a chicken, I have to leave the Freeport area because the Freeport area doesn't let you tame anything here. All you can do is kill stuff. Um, which is great because it's a good way to level up, but it's really annoying when you want to take a chicken with you to your new home, wherever you decide to go, and you actually can't take a chicken with you because you can't tame it. So, uh, gotta leave the Freeport area, so I just spent a little bit of time recrafting the raft, uh, getting some materials together, so we should be all set to leave. I'm hoping we don't die. All right, let's make sure we've got all of this stuff filled up completely. I'm hoping um, we could actually make another one, and I'm tempted to do that, but I think we'll be okay if we don't. All right, let's go ahead and go back. Um, I'll put the rest of the food on my hot bar, and then we should be all set to sail off, guys. <laughs> Hit an elephant and run. Uh, we could do that. We could do that. Here. This is the fun part. I'm gonna wait for my stam to come back. Punch. Run. Up. Can he go over that? Oh, he can. That's terrifying. It's okay. We're gonna swim around the island. He won't be able to find us. <laughs> um... Victor says, if I ever miss a stream, I always we watch them. Oh, thank you. That is appreciated. Those views after the stream has gone live, they make a big difference in terms of uh, getting everything, like, sorted out. So I do always appreciate when people watch them later if they can't make it to the actual live stream. Uh, bye, ghost. Thanks so much for watching today and stopping by. All right. Toast is over there. I think we've got everything, guys. We have water. We have food. I'm going to put these down here. I'm going to grab the berries from the box and put those on my hotbar. And we are going to sail off as fast as we can and see if we can find another island to get to. Oh, man. I'm super excited. I need to get out of this Freeport. Uh, Matt Star says, what was chasing you? It was an elephant. <laughs> I punched an elephant at the request of one of my mods. Ugh, can I get up, please? Thank you. Uh, Bo, thank you so much for the super chat. He says, is that elephant punch truck? <laughs> Bo, always, always with the really good puns on the channel. Thank you so much for the super chat, Bo. Uh, that was amazing. All right, guys, we're going to go out to open sea. Hopefully we don't die. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the map here. Okay. This is very... It's difficult to see. Let's see if I can... I can't really scroll in and out. Nope. I cannot scroll in and out. But uh, 
do have the map here. This is the island we're currently on. So the goal is to leave this region. So I am going to go ahead and just start um, sailing, I guess. Let's go ahead and rotate the sails this way, straight out to open sea. And then we're going to open all of the sails. All right. Here we go, guys. Let's hope we don't die. Let's hope we don't die. Username Gaming, thank you so much for subbing and welcome to the channel. All right. Straight on into the ocean, everybody. We're saying goodbye to the Freeport. Uh, I don't think I'm going to miss it very much at all. We're just on our little raft. Hopefully we find an island pretty soon because, oh my gosh, it would be terrifying if we, uh, if we died out here. Would not be good to have to start all over again. I'm, I really think it's funny how many elephants are over on that little thing. All right, we're going, we're going guys. <laughs> um, <laughs> Victor says, can iguanas sim swim well? Uh, yes, especially marine iguanas. They're very, very good at swimming. This is terrifying. This ocean is huge. It's very pretty. I have absolutely, like, no idea where we're going. I really hope we run into, um, an island soon, because it's scary to leave the big islands. It really is. Um, I'm hoping we run into something. Golden Ash, thank you so, so much for the super chat. It says, here's my monthly payment. It's going to be Sep. Oh, awesome. Thank you. Uh, yep, then you are all set, uh, Golden Ash, for sure. Uh, and again, thank you for the super chat. Alright, bye Jay the Destroyer, thanks for watching today. Flip the table says punch a chicken and run. I'm pretty sure that won't do too much if we punch a chicken and run. Alright. We're still going. I can kind of see that one. Let's see if we can see anything over the waves here. I'm just looking for any little bit of land. Uh, I'm not seeing anything. Oh man, this is scary. I have no idea how this is going to turn out, guys. I really don't. I'm hoping we can get pretty far, but who knows. Uh, Nijay Rivera, my day is pretty good. How's yours? Oh hey, the, ri the raft has a level up. Um... Access ship properties? How do I do that? Options? Access ship properties. Ooh. Sturdiness. Let's do that. Oh, man. Cool. So you can, like, add crew weight and stuff, but I want to add sturdiness since we're, like, out in the middle of nowhere. And I'm really hoping we don't die out here. Uh... Amira Garba, thank you so much for the super chat, guys. Please do thank Amira in the chat. And Gold Nash as well. Thank you, Ash. She says again, or she says again, P.S. You're amazing. Thank you so much, Ash. You are awesome. Oh my goodness. Guys, we're like in the middle of nowhere. This is horrifying. I'm like legitimately scared of water IRL, so this is... um. This is starting to freak me out. I don't like being out on the open ocean. Luckily, we're okay in terms of, uh, like, sturdiness. Our raft is all right. We're still okay on food. So we'll probably be okay. I'm going to eat a few vegetables there. Oh, there it is. I think this is the border between us and the next server, guys. All right, can we go through? Oh, yes. Cool. Okay, so we made it to a new region. Oh, heck. Okay, little bit of hiccup there because it switches you to a new server. Excellent. All right. Okay, so we successfully sailed to a new region. Um, so now we need to find an island. There is one up there. Hopefully, hopefully that'll work. Um, that's kind of a big island, so it's pretty close to the Freeport, so it's probably pretty well occupied as is, but we're going to stop by that island anyway, maybe refuel, see what's out there. That is terrifying. 
What is that? I'm like, I'm afraid to jump on this raft because it might like knock me off, but I don't. What is that? Is that like a ghost ship? That is terrifying. What is going on? Oh my god, guys, this game. I'm already freaked out by this game and I've barely played like a few hours on it. Uh, Pepijin, did I pet my dogs after yesterday's stream? I absolutely did. And it was great. Oh, look, there's like stuff floating. I want to go get the floating treasure purple thing, but I'm afraid of that ship. So we're just going to keep going to the island and I'm not going to die. That's the plan. Uh, DSavage649, thank you so much for subbing. Welcome to the stream today. Chase, am I regretting leaving the island? Not yet. That thing isn't chasing me yet. So I think I'm okay. It's just scary. I have no idea. Like, what is that? I didn't, I didn't know how much stuff I was going to run into out on the ocean because, like, the ocean appears large and empty. But, um, yeah, that's nice and scary. Oh, and it's gone. Cool. I'm, I'm okay with that being gone, actually, to be honest. All right, I feel like we're in an okay position to kind of be towards this island. We have the wind with us, so we're moving all right. Um, yeah, I think we're doing okay. I'm kind of just, like, checking to see if there's any other land in sight. I, I am aiming for this island. I do think I want to stop by there and see what we can find in this lawless region, and hopefully we don't die. What is that? What is that? What is that? That's a thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's slow down a little. Is that salvage? What is that? That looks like treasure. Okay, okay. I want to get closer. Ah! No! I smashed it! No, I didn't mean to smash it! Oh, and it damaged me. I was trying to grab it, but I couldn't get it. Alright. Well, uh, we're gonna open all the sails and keep going then. Since that did not work super well. And I'm legitimately afraid to stay in the water too long. Um, <laughs> not just says that's a ghost ship, don't go to it, run. Yeah, definitely did run. I, I don't feel prepared to handle the big ghost ships yet since I am just a solo person on a tiny raft. And now I'm going to have to even repair my raft. Oh, I'm hungry. Okay, we're eating. We're good. I've got all the vitamins. All the vegetables, all the little things. We're good. I'm okay. Okay, we're getting close. I am a little upset. That cool loot crate thing. If I hadn't smashed it, we would have been all right. But I was afraid to jump off and get it. I guess next time we'll have to be a little braver. Ooh, what is that? There's like some crazy lights going on over here, and I'm not sure how I feel about it. Can we get into, like, calmer waters here? Uh, Deep says, when are you going to live face arc video? Um, I don't have any plans to live stream uh, or f do a face cam or a face reveal at this time. Um, for work reasons, I really can't do that. Oh, that's a lighthouse. Uh, hold on, hold on. Alright, let's slow down. Slow down, and we're going to rotate. There's a lighthouse there, so let's actually rotate a lot. Let's go 90 degrees, and then open the sails a little more so we turn a little faster. This is really tricky. I don't want to get my ship, my raft, smashed on anything. All right, let's see if we can uh, rotate even more. All right, the wind's not with us this way. Oh man, looks like someone else is over here as well. Alright, yeah, we're totally losing the wind as we do this. But if we can make it over that way, we'd be in pretty good shape, I think. I think. We'll see. Um, 
Let's see. Helity Gamer says, I got the Primal Pass. Congrats. That is awesome. Uh, definitely, definitely do love the Primal Pass business. That is good stuff. All right. Uh, there we go. And then let's fully open all sails. All right. We're not going to move very fast since the wind is like completely against us. Oh, yeah. We're totally flapping in the wind here. But we should move a little. All right, if we move this way, okay, we've got a little bit of wind on us. <laughs> Bo says, no toast for you, scurvy buildrap. Back to the foredeck, be off with you. Pretty much, right? All right, we've got some wind with us again. Oh, yes. Okay, we've got this. Um, rotate the sails. We're going to bring it in a little bit closer. And then we can drop anchor once we're up there. I do see a horse, so that is definitely good. All right, we're going to get a little closer. I have no idea what that golden thing is. I want it. Is that treasure, actually? Uh, let's fully close all sails. We should be okay here. All right, and then repair the ship and options. Ship properties, we're going to go with... Um, Hmm. Let's see. Weight? I don't really need too much in the way of weight. Uh, I think... Yeah. I think just more sturdiness. The more sturdy this raft is, the happier I'm gonna be. Okay. Uh, let's jump in, guys. <laughs> oh, it's scary. Alright. I don't like the ocean. But I do like this. Ooh, I got a treasure map. Okay, so once you leave the free port, um, there's a lot more stuff. And we made a discovery. Excellent. Cool. Okay, so this is where we're at um, on the edge. This is a big island, which is actually probably pretty good. So let's see what we can do here. Ooh, treasure contains 36 gold. Oh, that's excellent. Placed in your item slots leads you to a hidden treasure. And then you have to use a shovel to dig for. Okay, so we're going to need a shovel first. So I think we're going to have to level up first. I'm going to learn the taming skill. Um, so we need to learn how to make stuff, basically, I think is the goal here. You're not mean, are you? No? Cool. We're good. As long as nothing's aggressive, I'm happy. Looks like there's plenty of people who have already been building in this area, though. Uh, tame the horse. We do not yet have the skill to tame the horse. That's a level 2 skill. Ooh. I feel like those are berries. I have no idea. Okay, we actually need some fish as well. We're gonna need a lot of fish. Uh... Let's see, am I going to play TTT with Ghost and you later? Uh, yes, I will probably be playing Ark with you all later. Um, once I kind of, actually, I don't know. Today's busy because I have a lot of work to do, hopefully, but it, it kind of depends on what happens after the stream. A tag, this is PvE. I'm not a huge fan of PvP in general, especially not with a game that's early access and super buggy. Oh, that was... Nice and scary. All right. Big old bear. Hi, bear. Let's back away slowly. Don't be... Why are you following me? Okay. Okay, you stay over there. I will avoid you. I'm good with that. Heck. <laughs> Ooh, a rabbit. Okay. I wonder if I can sneak up on the rabbit. I would like a rabbit. Um... Han says, Iguana, will you still do ARC? Uh, yes, I am still doing ARC. I released a video on it, like, earlier today, so should be totally fine. This rabbit looks a little funny. Okay, I would need carrots to tame you. Got it. Let's see, what's the name of the server? Because I want to enter with you. Uh, this particular server is just the North American region PvE server, so you should be able to find it. 
Um, it is just the official server right now, and I'm working on getting a private server set up, but uh, don't have one just yet. So still, still kind of in the process of doing all that. Oh, man. I'm, like, getting all of the items, which I really appreciate. I like just, like, digging stuff up. Okay. This, this island is so much better than the other islands. What can I say? Oh, cool. It looks like we have, like, hawks. Or maybe that's a parrot. I'm not sure. Definitely have bears. Definitely have boars. Looks like we have mountain goats. It would be great if I could find a chicken, but uh, I feel like chickens are going to be hard to find. Uh, Nina iPad says, hi, what did I miss? Uh, not too much. We sailed ourselves out of the Freeport region. We're now in the lawless zone where things are a little bit more terrifying. Saw a ghost ship and ran away from it because I am so not prepared for that. Oh, it's a seagull. Now it's my dead seagull. I'm going to harvest it up for hide. Um, Bratu says, Iguana, will you ever play on Dodo Mobile? Uh, if that is a server, probably not, because I exclusively play on my own servers. Uh, that's just kind of the way that I've decided to play the game, because I don't have a ton of time to join random servers. Um, so I pretty much only play on the servers that I'm already on. That's a B. Ah! Ah! No, 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 no. No bees. No bees. Oh my gosh. Not good. Okay. No. Get off. Get off. I didn't know giant bees were a thing. Apparently there's a hive nearby. There must be if there's that many bees. Um... <laughs> Leah says, I got rained on my server. Can I join your server in ARC? Uh, yeah, I do actually have two free fan servers that you are able to join. Actually, three. Um, I almost forgot about the PVX server. I have three free access servers that you can join for ARC. So if you are looking for a good community, definitely check those out because we have pretty good people and um, all of the admins do their best to keep everything friendly and make sure everybody's having a good time on those servers. So definitely check that out. It's a shape. What tier of animal are you? Can I tame you? I do have some chamomile. I have a ton of it. Can I tame you? I kind of want a male sheep. <gasps> yes. Guys, we're going to get a sheep. Uh, Fluffy Rock Drake says, how could you, Iguana? I'm sorry, I don't know what I did. Uh, Rad, no, you cannot have the toast, but yes, you're still my favorite. It's okay. Uh, you get honey so you can tame the bear. Oh, okay. That makes sense. I'm afraid of the bear, though. I feel like it's going to attack if I get too close. I'm going to get me this sheep. It's going to take a while, but I'm going to get the sheep. Meyer says, which server are you going to play on later? I might play. Uh, the plan was to go on the Patreon server, but we'll see how that works out because I do have a lot of work today. So I might not be able to do that. <laughs> um, Cybernova says, it's a sheep. It's a Shep. Yes, it is a Shep. I'm very excited. And luckily I have all the chamomile. Apparently it's a tier one tame. Oh man, I'm so excited I'm able to tame anything now that I've left the Freeport region. This is so much better. Chrissy says, I'm getting Subnautica on Saturday. Congrats, Subnautica is an amazing game. I'm excited for you. I really am. Uh, I can't wait until Subnautica comes out with their expansion. That's going to be a, probably my favorite thing ever. <laughs> Flip says name it BAP. We could definitely name it BAP. Uh, what level am I in ARC? Yam, yeah, it, it definitely varies depending on what server I'm in. But in my Patreon server, I believe I'm like level 91 or 92. Um, I'm up pretty high there now. This is like Taming Griffin. Um, it's actually way easier than taming a griffin, for sure. This passive tame method, I really enjoy. And we're getting a couple percent per, and these are vanilla rates, so I think that's not too bad for a level 10 sheep. It's not a level 1, and I, I am pretty satisfied with, uh, if we get a sheep today, I will be happy with life. I gotta figure out how to get it onto the raft, but then, uh, 
then it should be fine. Since I do think I want to find my own like little island to uh to get. Um, Slime Wolf says I'm going to go, but I am coming back. Awesome, Slime. I really hope you do. Atlas is taking over all of Arcs, says Fluffy Rock Drake. Uh, I don't think it's taking over. I think it's a very different game. Uh, everyone who plays Ark is really excited about Atlas because it's made by the same, a lot of the same people, and it's very similar in terms of mechanics, but, man, uh, it's, I don't know, it's a different game, and so it's really fun, and I think everyone's just excited because it's so new. Everyone's, like, flooding to it to try to, uh, play, basically. Uh, Holiday Gamer says, how do I become a patron? You become a patron by going to the link that Nacho Cheese has posted in the chat. Um, signing up at the $5 tier if you want access to the patron server. Uh, if you just want to support them, support the channel, there is a $1 tier that doesn't get you access to any servers, but it does help to keep the channel running. Uh, the $5 tier will get you access to the patron server for Arc Mobile and any other future patron servers that I have on. And let's see here. <laughs> uh, Arvind King Channel says, is there Thyla in Arc Mobile? Because I haven't seen one yet. I would like to tame one. Uh, no, they haven't added the Thyla in Arc Mobile yet, sadly. Hopefully they do at some point. I would really like to see that. But um, so far as I know, it's not been added yet. <laughs> Flip says everyone say F to confuse Iguana. Everyone wants to confuse me. Why? Uh, sheep to ship will be sheep ship shape. <laughs> oh my gosh. Bow with the tongue twisters. I love it. Come on, little sheep. Be my friend. He will eventually be my friend. It will be a thing. I'm going to have this happen. I'm going to eat some wild beans and some berries. All right. Can I? Nope, not yet. Ah, you moved. You moved. Don't move. I feel like their hitbox is a little bit too small. Uh, Maliki Bane says, when are you doing a face reveal? When I can. Uh, it's not going to be for quite a while yet. I do still have, uh, for work reasons, I cannot actually do a face reveal for quite a while yet. Um, but hopefully eventually. Kazoo says, this game has been getting a lot of negative reviews. I think it's an alpha, so things will be fixed. Uh, yeah, it is still early access, and I can see why people would give it negative reviews, just because it, the mechanics are very similar to Ark. Um, and on top of that, there it's very, very buggy. Like, it's incredibly buggy. But after that, um, I think the game's... A good concept. It's super fun, uh, and I'm really enjoying just the general gameplay. And once you get the hang of it, like it's not hard to to play and to do stuff. And they are actively updating like every day to try to make sure that things are getting fixed and are starting to work. Is iguana sheep overlord? I will be. Uh, where do you find goats in Arc Mobile? Uh, there aren't any goats in Arc Mobile. There aren't any Avis or anything like that, unfortunately yet. They haven't added those creatures. Uh, Arvind says, I'm not sure why I can't donate. Hopefully I can donate. Oh, that's all right, Arvind. Uh, liking and subbing make just as big of a difference as donations do, believe it or not. Um, they really do help to get more views on the channel, which generates more revenue. And subbing, obviously, uh, basically means that more people will be watching the channel, the more people that sub. So it's good stuff. Victor Yen says, tame a penguin if you can, because you can hug them. Uh, yeah, if we can make it down to the north region at some point, I doubt it will be today, because the map is just massive. It's so many servers just stuck together, um, and we are not quite to the, uh, we're, we're basically in, like, the tropical temperate region. We're not anywhere near where we could do, um, an actual tundra region sale yet, but eventually we'll get there. Come on, sheepy. There we go. <laughs> uh, let's see. Archfiend says, hey, Iguana, how have you been? And you are taming sheep. I can't wait to see this. 
Hey, Archfiend. I've been great. How have you been? Um, yeah, we are taming a sheep. I'm excited about it. It takes forever, but we're about 40% there, and I've definitely spent longer taming some things in Ark, so I'm okay with it. There is a horse over there, but I do need to get um, one more tier before I can tame horses. So they are rideable, so I can't tame one of those yet because I don't have the tier to tame them yet. But I will be able to once I level up a little bit. Come on, sheep. Tame up. I need, I need a sheep. I need the wool. Uh, Kazoo says, I'm trying to get on to lend a hand if I spawn on your island, but my atlas is acting up. Oh, that would be awesome if you could, for sure. Um, I don't mind people who can play atlas trying to pop in and help. We are in the A4 region. Dilan says, Iguana, use a soothing balm on it. That would be amazing. <laughs> Uh, Chris Dexton says, oh, the goat is cute. It is super cute. Look at this guy. He's all, like, stripey. I love him. I can't wait until he's my friend. Uh, Joshua Squad says, hey, what are your PC specs? By the way, I love your vids. Thank you, Joshua. Uh, my PC specs. Oof. Uh, let me see if I can remember. 24 gigs of RAM. Um, the storage, obviously, is super variable. I have an i7 processor. And I've got a 2080 Ti Founders Edition graphics card. Yeah, I think those are the major specs. Um, yeah, so those are the major ones. If there's anything specific you'd like to know, uh, let me know. Because I, I didn't build this PC entirely by myself. Um, so I only know like half of the details of it. It's very buggy. The sheep just kind of like walks through you occasionally. It's great. I don't know what this Shisandra is, but um, I'm going to roll with it for a while. Alright. I need to get some fish soon. I'm definitely going to have to go catch some fish. <laughs> uh, Little J says, I'm disappointed in myself. I killed my Equus by drowning it when my game crashed over the ocean near the southern islands. Oh no, Little J, that's the worst. Were you able to revive it at least? Ugh. <laughs> Uh, Tixer says, hi, love your vids, Iguana. Thank you so much, Tixer. That is very appreciated. You are awesome. Uh, in this game, there is no soothing bomb. Uh, that's right, Yam, there isn't. I believe they were trying to make a joke there by telling me to use a soothing bomb, which would be great if there was a way to make this taming go a little bit faster. <laughs> Asmore says, I like your videos, but I won't sub and like. Okay. <laughs> that's fine thank you for watching them though um Josephina says what did I miss well we sailed out of the Freeport region we are now on an island in one of the lawless regions and we've got ourselves a little sheep here that we're trying to tame up I'm really excited about it I'm gonna pick a little bit more chamomile here we're taming it up we're almost 60% of the way done and then we'll have our very first ever friend on on the atlas which is going to be amazing i'm gonna have to check on my raft occasionally too oh no are those wolves i don't, if those are wolves i don't want to go anywhere near them no they is that a sheep okay okay it's a sheep we're good we're good i don't need to be afraid let's put the spear away oh man i was going to be super terrified because if that was actually if that was actually a wolf, that would have been bad. Wolves are OP in any game. Um, Tixer says, please answer, I love your vids, please swim my name, and please shout out, I have a new channel. Uh, Tixer, please do not advertise in the chat, but I did just say your name and have actually shouted you out, so there you go. Uh, Leah says, am I weird because I love your voice? Uh, no, I do think that's actually part of what makes... YouTube great is that you can listen to people whose voices make you happy for whatever reason. A tag says, how isn't it? Um, do you mean how is it? Uh, Atlas is pretty good. I'm having a lot of fun on it. Unfortunately, the sheep is slow, but I do want it. Be afraid of the sheep. I know a little grip, right? 
Atex says, how is this different than Arc? Oh, gotcha. Um, so first off, it's built on a newer engine uh, than actual Arc is. So a lot of the gameplay controls, a lot of the graphics look very similar, but the water um, texture is much, much better. It's like very beautiful. On top of that, most of the taming here is either passive or uses like a bola to hold things still so that you can passive tame. So there's not like a knockout tame. Um, on top of that, it is very different aesthetically. Like you're a pirate instead of, um, instead of like a survivor. So your character looks a little different. There's a little bit more in terms of like clothing customization, which is kind of nice. You can get skins for stuff, which is great. Um, you can get NPCs as crewmates. So you can actually like tame people in a manner of speaking. You hire them, but there you go. Um, yeah, I don't know all the ways it's different in yet, because I only have explored a very small part of the game so far. But so far, I like that it's similar to ARK in terms of controls, but different in terms of content, because it does make it good. There you go. Um, let's see, Josephina says, I found your channel when I shear her up how to hatch eggs. Uh, oh yeah, that hatching eggs channel uh, video has done very, very well. Bright Diamond says, hi, do you remember me? I'm sorry I missed two of your streams. Bright Diamond, I do remember you, and thank you so much for coming and watching today. Totally fine that you missed a couple of streams. You can't make them all. Life happens. <laughs> Name it Horned Zebra. Name it Toast Warrior. I do like all of these ideas here. <laughs> um, in any type of game, does Wolf doesn't need saddle? Uh... I actually don't know how the wolves are in this game. Oh, no, no, no. No bees. No. You're in the way. You're in the way. I don't, I don't like bees. Okay, I killed one. Alright, I gotta kill these other bees. There's two. Oh no, I'm gonna lose taming effectiveness. Is that the third one? Okay. Ugh. I want to focus on my sheep. All right. Uh, there's also a combat system for this game. So you have like different types of specific moves you can do. You have um, a bunch of different types of punches, uh, a targeting system that you can enter and exit. It's actually very cool. Name it skunk. <laughs> Toast oddity. Um, Celeste says, do you have something like Alexa or Hey Google? Um, not on my computer. I mean, obviously, Siri on my Apple uh, phone, and yeah, I don't have anything that, like, controls my house, unfortunately. So they're a little bit pricey. Holiday Gamer, you've been shouted out. Name it, I don't care, sheep. <laughs> it's not bad. Uh, D Savage, I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, I feel like you probably need to deal with that. Um... Momo says, hi, I'm new to your channel. I'm definitely subscribing. Oh, thank you, Momo. Welcome, and I'm really glad that you're enjoying. Josephina says, is this almost like ARK, or it is ARK? Uh, it's almost like ARK. It's almost like ARK. It is not actually ARK, guys. There are plenty of differences uh, once you start playing that really do make it feel very different. Oh, there is a wolf over there. That's terrifying. All right, sheepy, stay up this way, please. Let's not go near the wolf. All right. I, I don't want to go near the wolf. The wolf is bad. The wolf is very bad. I can throw spears, which does a lot of damage if you hit it right, but uh, it is terrifying. Uh, Bratu says, I am watching from Romania. I am so hyped. Awesome, Bratu, welcome. Um, Arvin says, have you worked together with other YouTubers like Syntac, Nerd or Flinger? Flinger's my fave. I actually really love Flinger's content, and no, I've not had a chance to work with some of those bigger names in, like, the survival game stuff. Uh, I have worked with a couple of the smaller YouTubers that play Arc Mobile, like Retreen, um, and Master Arrow, and I haven't played directly with Schwalbe, but I would like to at some point, and I've also played with Cams25. Uh, eventually I would like to play with Flinger. That would be amazing. 
Rad, eat. There you go. <laughs> um, eh, almost. We're almost there on this guy. <laughs> Name it Zebra Goat. That is pretty good. Can you name the sheep Barry? Barry is a good name as well. Man, we're getting all of these great, uh, all of these great name suggestions here for the sheep. Basil Play says, oh man, another awesome game. I know, I'm really enjoying this one. It's super awesome. Can we, yes. Okay, we're getting there. Uh, Rohit says, watching from New Zealand. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize you were all the way in New Zealand, Rohit, but thank you for watching. We're almost there, guys. We're 95% tamed. I'm going to get this sheep, and then we're going to take it far away from the wolves. Ah, I wish they would not walk through me. That would be great. Joshua says, I'm watching in Holland, and it's 11.22 p.m. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, it's only like 2.30 here, so thank you for watching from that far away. It's crazy. And that late? Name it Zeb. That's pretty country. Ooh, Zeb is a good name, Bo. Alrighty. Almost, almost, almost. It is kind of a zebra sheep. Yes! Okay. A level 13 sheep, guys. So, um... Oh my gosh. We have a ton of really good name suggestions. I do like Zeb. I do like Rohit's suggestion of Badger. Z sheep or beep beep I'm a sheep horn toast or lamb chop I think I want to do like a combination of Zeb Zeb loaf oh my gosh Cedar Star says name it loaf uh, let's go ahead and name it Zeb loaf well, if I could type that'd be great nice okay so oh you can ride a sheep Oh, that's good. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay, so it's very similar, it looks like. Access the inventory. Let's give you a little bit of chamomile. Make you make you happy. Okay, I have no idea what to do with the sheep other than to uh, save it and call it beautiful. So you're going to come with me. We're going to take it back down by shore. Totally forgot I would have to feed this thing. That's going to be kind of a pain. But we should be getting relatively close to a level up. Now that we have this sheep, we can go f try to find something to, uh, to slaughter or hunt down. And then we should be in good enough shape to... Um, ooh, rushes. I hear those are what you tame cows with. So once we get this guy back down by the boat, we should be in good shape to go out hunting and try to get something else. Um, basically... Get some XP going, and then once we level up, we should be able to get riding on this guy because we can learn that tier 1 or tier 2 beast taming or whatever it is that lets us ride, which we should be able to do with one more level. Savage Patel, thank you so much for subbing. Welcome to the channel. I'm very excited to see you here today. Am I going the right way, even? I don't think I'm going the right way. Oh my gosh, I'm lost. Wait, wait, let's go this way. Come on, little sheep. We'll lead you back down to the shore somehow. Oh, no. Please don't let me be actually lost. <laughs> uh, Leah says, it's 1 a.m., but I love watching you. Oh, thank you so much, Leah. That is very appreciated. Okay. Okay. Okay, we found it. We found it. This is good. This is good. All right, and there's a horse. The sheep is really slow. There's a seagull. That's nice. That's a pretty horse. I like that color a lot. I want you to be my friend. We're definitely going to have to tame some horses uh, very soon as well. Ooh, another treasure map thingy. I wonder if it's the same one. Okay, we're going to take this sheep down here. Awesome. So it should be relatively safe here on the shore. I don't see too much else that's going to be a problem here. Um, behavior, let's see, disable following, no, why are you wandering, you should not be wandering, okay, stay, stay, 
I want to get this bottle real quick, and then I need to hunt up some fish. Awesome. Got another treasure map. Good. We can get some gold with that. Are there any fish in the area? Okay, there are a few fish. That's good. We're going to have to dive down and kill a fish because I definitely need, uh, I need the vitamin D. Okay, got a fish. Let's take it up on shore. Um, BTZ says it looks like Ark. Uh, yes, yes, it does look like Ark. Um, but it is not actually Ark. It's because they were built on the same engine, so they are going to look similar. And a lot of the inventory is very similar, uh, which I actually think is good. Like, I really appreciate that the inventory is similar because that saves me a lot of trouble in learning how to get through the game. But, uh, it's very different. Um, let's see here. Does anyone know where I can find a unicorn in Ark Mobile? Suresh, you can find, you can find a unicorn basically anywhere on the map at all. They do spawn randomly anywhere on the map. Um, they don't have like a specific, a specific location that they spawn in. Okay, I've got a vitamin D deficiency. Perfect, perfect timing to cook this fish up. Uh, let's go ahead and put some stuff there. All right, I'm actually going to eat a little bit of meat. All right, wait for this fish to get done. Is this a more modern version of Ark? Uh, Bright Diamond, no, it's definitely different. Um, definitely different than Ark for sure. All right, perfect. We got our vitamin D. I like it. All right, so we're going to get that fish all cooked up, and then we should be pretty well set in terms of having supplies. Let's go ahead and put a few more a few more wood in there just to make sure everything cooks up as it should. Come on, transfer over. There we go. Beautiful. Ooh, okay. That's awesome. Okay, so we can definitely go find quite a bit of gold as long as we keep getting these little treasure bottles, these treasure maps. Um, we should be in good shape to go and get a bunch of gold. So I'm actually going to grab another one of these. I'm going to collect some of these treasure maps because if I get a few of them, I'll feel pretty good about it. All right, killed the sea bass. I'm going to chop this guy up and cook him as well. I want to make sure I have lots of fish because vitamin D deficiency... It can be a big problem. All right, kill the fish. Give me all the meat. Oh, that's a good amount of meat. I like it. That's a ton of meat. That's very good. All right, swim back out. Make sure we're not going to get murdered by a shark or something. Looks like we're okay up here. Oh, man. The resources out here are so much better than back on the main island. Ugh in terms of, like, getting fish and stuff, because, uh, back at Freeport, man, everything is just fished out. <laughs> everyone needs fish, and so everyone takes fish. It's great. Um, Lightning Master says, what did I miss? Uh, we actually sailed out of the Freeport zone, and we tamed ourselves a sheep. We are cooking up some fish, and we're collecting a few treasure maps. I do want to go and kind of get some treasure now that I know that that's a thing. So I am trying to collect a couple of these treasure bottles um, to basically get myself in a position where I can go and uh, hunt down some cool treasure because I need some gold. I need to... Oh, man, we're going to restart the server in five minutes. That's all right. Uh, it should only be down for like a minute once that happens. We'll keep playing in the meantime. Yes. Get all these treasure maps. Yeah, we need some treasure because gold is how you buy crew members. And so if I get gold, I can get crew members. And if I get crew members, I don't have to worry so much about being finicky with the sails. Uh, the ship can kind of just do what it needs to do. And so I'm hoping that works out really well. I am going to try and get up to this river because I do need fresh water soon. Um, and so I want to make sure that that's a good source of fresh water. So let's go ahead and run up here and see if we can get get this all sorted out. 
And in the meantime, let's actually eat some chamomile so we have some more veggies in our system and some more berries in our system. All right, there's lots of little ridges you can't jump over. I don't know how I feel about that. There we go. All right, how's this river look? Is there a good, easy way to get down? No. Okay. Oh, is this like a crow? Oh, it is. It's a crow. Oh, it's cute. All right, we need a bola to entrap and feed. So we are going to have to craft a tannery at some point. Um, that's not the easiest thing in the world to do, unfortunately, but we will give it our best go. Okay, is there a way to get down here and then get back up? That's the major question. I don't think so, but we can go over that way. So let's go around. Um... <laughs> See, Mr. Random says, tell everyone I stupidly dropped my phone in my toilet. Oh, no. Oh, that's, that's not good. That is all kinds of just not good. I'm, I'm curious to know what you did with it after, but I'm also afraid. What is wet wood? What can you do with wet wood? Oh, is it just another type of wood? That is weird. They do definitely have a lot of items in this game that, um... Ooh, a rattlesnake! Okay. Well, we killed a rattlesnake. I hurt the sheep in the process, but I killed the rattlesnake. Let's go ahead and, uh, chop this guy up. So apparently we need to be really careful. I didn't know there were rattlesnakes in the game. I had seen bigger snakes, like terrifying snakes, but I didn't know big rattlesnakes were in the game. Oh my goodness. Yeah, you definitely have to watch yourself out here. The lawless land is pretty dangerous. There's a lot of things that do want to kill you. <laughs> um... Bright Diamond says, yesterday I was looking for an ecosystem, but I couldn't find any. I searched everywhere into the middle of the map until I found three or four altogether. I only tamed one. Yeah, equus are a rare spawn. Like, they're, they're a relatively uncommon spawn, and then when they do spawn in, um, it, it can take quite a while to, uh, like, usually they will spawn in in groups of, like, two to four. So, that's, it's, it's another thing to be aware of with those guys. All right, I need to craft another spear. What else do I need? Fiber? Okay, let's go pick some fibers. Because spear is all I have in terms of defense right now. And we're going to need to kill some stuff for sure. I, I keep getting Shisandra and not fiber. I need fiber. What about these? No. I need fiber. Where are all the fiber plants? No. No, no, no. There is a female sheep here. We could tame a female sheep, guys, but that would take a while. Ooh, straw. Oregano. Oh my goodness. I think the straw is fiber, so I think we'll be okay with that. Um, what system is this game for? Uh, Josiah Lassane, this game is for PC only at the moment. It is early access on PC. So it's not widely available yet. Um, hopefully they do make it available to more people in the future. That would be pretty great. I'd be pretty happy if they did that. All right, rushes are considered a thatch. This is so interesting how everything is classified differently. Um, okay, so these berries are edible, that's good. We'll just, uh, we'll eat those. And now we should be able to make Another spear? No. Wait. Is straw fiber? Yeah, it's fiber. Okay, we just don't have a lot of it. Got it. There we go. There's some straw. Bombers11, totally fine if you can't watch. Thanks for stopping by and leaving a comment in the chat. Gamerboss says, why did she stop? Uh, not sure what you mean. As far as I know, everything is still running. What level am I on Arc Mobile? Bright Diamond, I believe my current level on my Patreon server is like 91 or 92. It's pretty high up there. I'm pretty happy with the level that I've achieved. Alright, I'm going to eat more fish. 
on more meat and then more veggies as well. well I'm all out of wild beans now. Let's go ahead and eat a bunch of cilantro. I hate cilantro. It's disgusting. It's bad. All right. Yep. Stuck. Stuck on a mini cliff. Okay, so we are going to need to level up. So I'm actually going to start looking for something to basically beat up here. Hopefully we find something small enough for me to kill. I feel bad killing a sheep. That's a bear. I still don't feel like messing with bears. Someone has a storage box. Cool. Uh, what level am I in? Atlas. I believe I'm level 8 or 9. Um... Level 8. Yeah, I'm still level 8. So I've got a little ways to go. We should be able to hit level 9 here pretty soon if I just kill a few more creatures. It looks like crafting really doesn't give you that much in the way of XP, but killing creatures really does. Um, so we have to find something that we can actually kill here. There's a boar. I bet I could kill a boar. I might want to make another spear before I try to kill a boar. Now, if you throw a spear, you do a little bit more damage. I've kind of learned a few tricks here. What level are you? Level one. Yeah, we can do that. All right, there we go. And then we can actually pick these spears back up, which is useful. Cool. So we killed ourselves a boar, and we're getting some resources from that. Um... <laughs> Please name the goat Texas, please answer. Uh, Tixer, we can definitely name something, um, name something Texas in the future for sure. Uh, the goat already has a name now. The sheep has a name. So we will probably have to save that for the next one. But uh, it's definitely possible. Is that a horse or another goat? Oh, it's a horse. Okay. All right. Looking for something else to crack down on. I need to be able to build... I need to craft a shovel, and I need to be able to um, ride the sheep because I feel like that's necessary. So I just need to level up, see what we can do about getting myself a shovel, uh, definitely see what we can do about getting myself a few more riding tiers and doing all of that good stuff. Ooh, this is a weird rock. Uh, I can't pull anything out. I think the server might be offline now. Um, let's see. Uh, bears might kill you if you get close to them. Yes, they might. I am afraid of that, which is why I haven't really messed with them. Uh, it looks like we're either bugged out or... Yeah, I feel like we might be bugged out right now. Or they're restarting the servers, because they did say they were restarting them in five minutes. Uh, can I tame that horse? We can try to tame the horse once we uh, get back online. I may have to actually exit the game here and then rejoin. Um, that might be a thing, guys. That really might be a thing. Uh, I don't think it's a crash. I think it was done on purpose. Oh, yeah, it's crashing. <laughs> They were going to restart the servers for maintenance, so it should be okay. Uh, we'll be back in just a second. All right, we lost the connection. We should be able to just rejoin here. What's my favorite dino I've tamed in Ark? Definitely an Iguanodon, but um, I really am a big fan of Barfiric right now. My griffin in Ark Mobile, he's pretty great. Okay. I feel like this is right before we killed the boar. It is. It's before we killed the boar. That's frustrating. Um, oh, man. And I lost some XP. On the upside, uh, <sighs> I'm trying to think of the upside now. <laughs> man, these restarts are a little bit rough to deal with. Uh, all right, let's make sure everything's full. Oh, that's a wolf. That's a wolf. Jump, 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 jump. Hi, wolf. Wolfy friend. Uh, can I hit you? You know what? I'm going to headshot it.
Oh, no. All right, well, I should be able to kill it. There we go. Cool. Okay, and wait, where did the body go? Wait, 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 wait. I just did all that work. I got my spears back, but the wolf body glitched away. Oh, no, there it is. Ugh. I was going to be really upset for a second. Okay, we're good. We're good. I can still harvest this thing. Ugh. Would I choose an aloe or a carno? Uh, Endercat, I would probably choose a carno because I actually really, really love carnos. Um, let's see. I should kill my sheep and then make toast out of it, then name it Stripey Toast. That's an idea. That's actually an idea. I'll think about that. I'll keep that in mind. All right, there's a sheep. Let's go ahead and make some more spears, because uh, that restart definitely took down... I had more spears than that. Um, where's the sheep? The sheep is down by the boat. It is safe on the beach. All right, we still have everything else. Okay, bones are carotenoids. Okay, cool. We're good then. Um... Basil says, Iguanodon are OP with unlimited stam. Yes, they super are. Nitro type hacker 24, I do remember you from yesterday. Diamond Toffee says, guys, what do you do in this game? It seems fun. Uh, Diamond, you can tame creatures, you can build bases, you survive, and it's an MMO. So you have a lot of people to interact with if you feel like it. It's actually pretty amazing. I'm going to kill this sheep, guys. If you're sensitive, look away. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to headshot it. All right. Let's get this going. Uh, I want to make sure my aim's right. There we go. Had to do it. I needed the XP. <laughs> um, would I recommend this now for someone that doesn't like to deal with bugs? Tickle, no. Um, this game is extremely buggy right now. It is early access. It just dropped like five, four or five days ago. So... Yeah, I, I highly recommend that if you don't like bugs, you don't play this game. However, if you can handle a few bugs in the interest of having a fun experience, um, play this game. This game is good. It's going to be amazing. But if you're driven nuts by like the state of Arc Mobile right now, this game will, is not for you. Um, it's too early. There's too many bugs. Uh, you're going to have to... You're going to wait. You're going to want to wait. Um... All right, it's getting a little dark here, guys. Let me see if I can pull out my torch. Okay. All right. It's so weird that the torch just like sits on you. I mean, it's nice because I can use my hands, but it's weird. I'm not used to it. Okay, definitely gathering a few more things here. Rushes are kind of thatchy, so I want something else. All right, all I'm gathering is rushes and wet wood. Interesting. All right, we can head back kind of towards the sheep. We should be really close to a level up, so I just need to find, like, one more thing to hunt down. I don't really want to hunt down the horse. Um, yeah, I don't want to hunt down the horses. The horses are too cute. If I find another boar or another wolf, we can hunt that down for sure. That level 10 wolf was actually really tough, so I'm a little bit afraid of that. Like, if we find another wolf, I could be in trouble if I don't have a way to, like, get up and away from it. There's a boar. We might be okay taking down a boar if it's a low enough level. Uh, Parker Ross says, hi, I'm here. What did I miss? Uh, not too much. We sailed out of the Freeport zone. We tamed ourselves a sheep. Um, and we are hanging out. Wild female pig level 10. That's pretty high level. Let's see what we can do. Oh, no. Am I out of spears? I'm out of spears! Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Bad, 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 bad. No. Die, pig. Die, pig. Oh, I forgot. I didn't... No. No, no, no. Let's just run. I didn't realize I was out of spears. That's very bad. Okay. Uh, I know kind of where we are, so we'll run back towards the beach. Hopefully not get killed. Um, zigzags. Zigzags and up and over rocks. And around sheep. Oh no. 
I just want to not die. That's the goal today. <laughs> okay, I hear the music stop. Are you still coming for me? You're still coming for me. No. I thought I was okay. Um. <laughs> oh, heck, this is not good. Okay. I don't see them anymore. I don't see them anymore. I didn't realize there were two there. That's a problem. Between that and not having uh, the extra spears, that's a big problem. Um, do I like memes? Uh, Bright Diamond, I do like memes. Freaking Squirrel says, I've been playing ARK PvP official since it was in beta, and honestly, I'm tired of ARK now. Too depressing. Is Atlas something new and refreshing? Uh, I actually think it is. Uh, it's really cool. No, why are you back? Um... <laughs> I'm really enjoying Atlas in general. I think it's a great game. I think there's a lot of cool mechanics to it um, that are slightly different than Ark, just enough different to make it new, not enough different to make it like a whole new system that you have to learn. So it's actually kind of nice um, in that way in particular. But yeah, if you're interested in a PvP experience, once the bugs are smoothed out, I feel like the PvP is going to be amazing on this game because it is just such a massive game that it's going to be pretty incredible uh, in terms of being able to actually like have sea battles and stuff like that. I think it's going to be awesome. Alright, if the pig comes after me again, I now have a spear. Can I make another one? What do I need? Fibers. Okay, let's... I need straw. Give me straw. Not wet wood. I need straw. Okay, big problem is I'm trying to figure out which plants give me straw, and I'm not having too much luck, and that pig is still after me. Oh, it's definitely after me. Run away. No. Oh, it's so angry. All right, is it going away yet? Or is it gonna come at me? These are the real questions. Okay. Uh, it's still upset. It's, it's definitely still upset. <laughs> the problem is, is my spear will break and I can't get enough straw to make a second spear very quickly. Um, uh, all right, I keep getting berries and I don't need berries, I need straw. Is there, like, arc dinos on Atlas? Uh, Hans, no, there are not arc dinos on Atlas. There are more, like, real-world creatures, like tigers, elephants, giraffes, um, wild boar horses, and sheep, and chickens, and monkeys. So, like, more real-world creatures. And seagulls as well. Actually, I'm gonna kill this seagull. Because I can, and I needed to. XP. Any XP I can get is good. <laughs> Nitro says, Dang Iguana, I was like one of your 40th to 50th subs, and now you have 20k. Congrats on reaching 20k. Thank you so much. Yeah, that is super appreciated. Um, it has been an insane journey here, honestly, on the channel. I'm, I'm super happy with the way that all of this has worked out. Eat some chamomile here. Get that up. Get this up. I need more of the berries. And then I need more of fish. So I might actually need to go fishing. But I leveled up. Yes. I leveled up and the sheep leveled up. Oh, I'm happy. I'm very happy with that. Uh, let's level... Um... What should I level? Intelligence? Craft items quickly with additional stat bonuses. Reduce cooldowns on feats and utilization of magical skills. I have no idea what magical skills are, but I do need those. Great Opinion says, you need a sickle. Ah, yes, I do. That would actually be great. Uh, bye, Mr. Bannon. Thanks so much for coming out and watching today. And Jonathan Rondeau, thank you so much for subbing and welcome to the channel. I did see that notification. Thank you so much. It is very appreciated here. Uh, let's go ahead and go with Fortitude. I like not having my stats drain as quickly. Okay. Beast Mastery. Um... Riding. Yes, we're gonna do with the riding, and... Okay, what else do I need? So I need to be able to... 
craft things. Uh, I also need basics of the bow. A bow would be really useful, guys. What do you think? Bow or, like, getting into building and stuff like that because... Ooh, or harvesting. If I could increase the amount of harvesting, that would be useful as well. Hero, keep on marching on. Thank you so much for subbing and welcome to the channel. Kazoo says archery and Kazoo knows quite a bit. Uh, Ariana Fire, yes, I do remember you. <laughs> uh, dinosaur futuristic game and that means Ark is an oxymoron. Yes, I did say that and it kind of is actually. What editing software do I use on mobile? I actually use um, a PC editing software called, what is it, Shotcut? to edit all of my videos, so I download everything to my computer to edit because it's easier. Bow. Okay, everyone says get the bow. We're going to get the bow. We should be able to ride, though. Yes. Oh, guys. We can ride the sheep. We are too heavy for the sheep, but we can ride the sheep. I'm happy. Oh, my gosh. No, no, no. No, bugs. No, 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 no. Stop. Screen. I'm stuck. Okay, can we not? Okay. Back on the sheep. No. Oh, no. I don't like that. <sighs> okay, can we please? Okay. Oh, thank goodness. Um, Freakin' Squirrel, thank you so much for the super chat. He says, thank you for the tips. My new Atlas journey begins. LOL. Welcome, Freakin' Squirrel. Thank you so much for the super chat, and I am super glad that you were able to get some useful tips about Atlas from me. Uh, it's very new to me as well, so I'm glad that something I could do was helpful. Uh, Johnny Brunton, hello and welcome. <laughs> Pride Diamond says bugs. Yeah, so many bugs. Uh, Gravy456, I think I remember you. I do think I remember you. It has been a while. Um, okay, I need to make a boat. Oh, I need fiber. You know, I have fiber on the boat. I'm just going to grab my boat fiber. Uh, Commando Bar, welcome to the stream. He says, oh, mutton bustin'. Yes, I totally am mutton bustin'. It's fantastic. I need fish, too. Okay, I need to go fishing, but I'm gonna wait until it gets daytime. In the meantime, I'm gonna make a bow. Because I feel like a bow is gonna be useful. Um, I'm actually almost out of fiber on all counts. Heck. Oh, heck. Uh, how we doing? I need ten more? And then I'm completely out. And then I need to make arrows. Oh, man. I need to figure out where to get fiber on this thing. It's a problem, guys. Fiber is hard to come by on here for sure. All right. I am going to grab some of my aloe here so that I have some veggies. Okay. So we now have a bow. For some reason, it didn't equip onto my hotbar. Why? Can I... Why can I only equip it there? Why can I only equip these on one weapon slot? <laughs> I'm confused. That makes no sense at all. I should be able to carry both a spear and a bow. Oh, I like the little skull decoration on the bow. That's really cool. Okay, so good details on the graphics here, but... This feels buggy. I should be able to equip both a spear and a bow. That makes zero sense to me. So I'm going to go ahead and put the spear back on for now since I don't have any arrows. Ugh. Uh, Joshua, thank you so much. That is very appreciated. Froggy Plays and Tyrell Amber, hello and welcome to the stream. Amataki Gaming, welcome back. Excited to see you here today. All right, let's see if we can find some fiber. If I can find some good fiber bushes, I will be happy. I just need some some fibers, not chamomiles. I have too many chamomiles and too many berries. Like, I don't need any more food, guys. I need straw. Wait. Wait. These. The little fern things have straw. That's what I need. I'm going to eat a couple of these aloe while I'm at it. These. Yes. Okay. We'll get this. We'll get this. Anthony Lee says, what did I miss? Um, I'm not sure when exactly you left or if you're just popping in now, but 
basically we left the Freeport area. We are now in the lawless lands. We sailed to a new island, uh, tamed a sheep, killed a few things. Oh, we're now level nine and we just made a bow and found some more bugs, which are really fun. There was a lighting glitch right there. And now we are looking for fiber because we need fiber to make arrows because I want to be able to use my bow. Uh, the archery skill is armor piercing. Awesome. I like that a lot. Armor piercing is definitely good because that way I can maybe take down some pigs. All right. Oh my gosh. The fiber grind is real. Um... Tixer says, I gotta go to bed. I will go when you answer. Uh, I don't know what the question was, but I will try to answer if you post it again. Um, Cedar Star says, SS Toast was a good name. I thought so. I really thought so. I love the name SS Toast for our little ship. I think it's great. Um, let's see. Tickle says, I heard you can only have a single two-handed item on your hotbar at a time. That appears to be the case. Um, I guess that's because of the way that it's all set up on the character. So like you have the hatchet on one side, the pick on the other, the spear on the back, and then the torch is kind of tucked into your belt whenever it's on your hotbar. So I guess that makes sense, but it is annoying. I don't like it. It frustrates me. I hope we run into a chicken out here somewhere because I would really love to tame a chicken. I'm kind of obsessed with the chicken idea, guys. All right, let's get this. Uh, yes. Okay, cool. We hit 100 likes. Thank you so much, everyone in the chat for hitting that like button. It seriously does help. Uh, keeps the channel running if you hit that like button. Sure does. Mag, hello. I do remember you. Welcome back. Glad to see you. Am I quitting ARK Survival Evolved? Only use me closer. No, I am absolutely not quitting ARK. I am just checking out Atlas because it's a new game. And, you know, honestly, my channel was pretty much only ARK up till now. And so Atlas is a very similar game to ARK, but it is a different game. I wanted to round out some content. I wanted to play Atlas, um, and I wanted to play it on the channel specifically. And, yeah, I just wanted to have some fun with it. So I hope everyone is okay with me doing that because I felt like it was time to bring a new game to the channel. Ah! No. Oh. All right. I don't like that. I don't like snakes. I actually really love snakes IRL, but uh, didn't like that one. Did not want to duke it out with a, a rattlesnake. All right. Can I make a spear again? Please, game. There we go. No, what do I need? I need wood. Ooh. Okay. I need wood, and I can make some arrows. Let's make a couple of arrows. In the meantime, uh, we'll make like five arrows. I have no idea how well this is going to work. The spears are good for melee, so I feel a little bit nervous not having more of those. I need flint. Luckily, there are a ton of rocks in this area. Ooh, grad granite and... Radiolarite. I wonder... Granite must be stone. I wonder if the radiolarite is considered a flint. Yes, it is considered a flint. Cool. I want to break small rocks, not big ones, because big ones are good for, like, jumping on to get away from stuff. Um, Madison, I am doing great. How are you doing? And David Rogers, hello and welcome. I am doing great. Uh, Tixer... Good night. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope you had a good time on the stream. All right, we're going to break this little rock. Slate. I like slate. There we go. Um, <laughs> let's see. Team 10 Wolf, hello and welcome. All right, I already killed that rock. Let's get this one. Need more flint. Let's see. Uh, bye, Froggy Plays. Thanks so much for watching today. I hope you had a good time here on the, the channel. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. I kind of want to test out my bow. I don't like how the screen occasionally does that. Like, it darkens. 
and I don't know why, and I don't like it. I want to, I want my field of view uninterrupted. Right, let's go see if we can kill a sheep, because I feel like a sheep is going to be a little bit easier to kill. Level 18. That's pretty high level, but uh, we should be able to get it. Okay. Okay, these these arrows are, like, not really working. There we go. All right, am I getting my arrows back? Kind of. I'm kind of getting my arrows back. It's a little clunky. Like, not every shot hits or registers. I think that might be due to server lag as well. Um, but definitely helps for sure. Um, Ariana Fire says, I tried to explain why I'm watching someone else play a video game to an old Soviet grandpa and it didn't work. Any tips? Uh, ask them if they watch any sports. Um, because the way I like to explain it is, it's basically like watching a combination of sports and TV. It's not just watching someone play a video game. It's getting tips on how to play the game. It's being entertained by the people who are playing the game. And it's, um, it's basically like watching people who are either entertaining or good at what they do doing what they do and so that's how I try to explain it to people and it usually works when I'm like hey if you watch football clearly watching games isn't that weird because you're just watching people on a field I'm watching people like run around and do a story it's different but it's very similar uh, what Griffin last name do I see the most in ARC? I definitely see the uh, apostrophe I. I've seen a lot of those, and I do have a lot of those because of that. Okay, someone's got a little base up here on this hill. It's a good area for it. All right, lots of birds attacking a boar over there. That's interesting. I want to get another level, but I'm also, like, afraid to get another level. Ooh, let's actually check out the horse here. I'm going to sneak. Okay. No. No, no. Hold still. Be still. No, no, no. Be still. Be still. Okay, I have no idea how to tame you. I tried. I can't even see the instructions on it. Um, I'd be willing to bet it's... Oh, those are wolves. I don't want to mess with wolves. Um, I'd be willing to bet it's something similar to how you tame them in Ark, but you probably need a bola to hold them still, and so I'm going to need a tannery to make a bola, so I will have to hold off on that. Uh, yeah, unfortunately. We'll see if we can find another one in the woods here. If I can, I will definitely give it a shot, but I also need to go fishing again, so actually I need to make spears for fishing. What colors does a griffin come in? Um, they come in a lot of like browns and grays. I really love the ones that have like bright white on their wings. Those are like particularly pretty, but they do come in a large variety of colors. Um, usually like browns and reds are pretty common as well. Another sheep. I need more of those ferny bushes because I need more straw guys. I need all of the straw. I have one straw. Hey, I found celery. I don't even know when I found celery, but I found celery. <laughs> um, I also have fleece and flint. It's all good stuff, but the fiber is a problem. Oh my goodness. All of the fiber is a huge issue. I don't know why like the edges of my screen are all dark. I don't like it. I want it to go away. Um... I wonder if it's like a game mode I accidentally activated somehow. It shouldn't have been, though. Weird. Very, very weird. I feel like that may be a bug. Yes. Okay, these have straw. Um, File Thunder says, Hi, Iguana. Sorry I'm late. What have I missed? Tamed a Thyla today. Painted him. Siam. His name is Warrior. Congrats on a beautiful Thyla. They are amazing. Uh, we sailed out of the Freeport zone on Atlas here and tamed ourselves a sheep. Those are the major, like, talking points of the day. Was awesome. We had a lot of fun doing that. And now I'm just trying to collect fiber so we can make a spear because I need to go fishing. Because I'm running low on vitamin D again. And vitamin D deficiency is not fun. 
uh, in game or IRL, guys. Make sure you get enough vitamin D. Top life tips from the iguana. <laughs> um, oh my gosh, but straw is actually like limited here. I need a sickle or something. The problem is, is I don't know where to find one. Now, I know for a fact that I get straw from those little, uh, like, ferny plants, but I'm having trouble finding them, and I'm only getting berries from everything else, and I really don't need that many berries. Like, it's just not necessary. I have hundreds. Ah! Hi, pig. Okay, I need tier two taming to tame that pig. I need to level up for that. Yes, fern. Uh, what's my favorite color? My favorite color is actually probably like a dark green, um, but I also do very much enjoy blues and purples, all dark shades, as you can see by like the thumbnails on my channel. Um, those colors are actually like my favorite colors, those purples and blues and greens. Um, they're just very beautiful. I enjoy them a lot. Yeah, they're good. Um, hey, ghost, welcome back. Wasn't my goal to tame a chicken in the stream? It was, but I tamed a sheep instead, and now I can't find a chicken. I'm desperate for a chicken, but I don't see one anywhere. Uh, if there are pigs on that game, make bacon. David Rogers, there are pigs, and I killed one, but then the server reset, so we kind of have to, like, hold off on that. But it's definitely a goal of mine to make some bacon. It's a goal of mine to get a pig that I can, uh tame actually i would like to tame some pigs and then have like a little bacon farm i mean we do have our tamed up sheep here who is adorable oh i can access their inventory that's a good idea i can level them up they have like no health i'm gonna level up their weight because if i level up their weight enough i might actually be able to ride them and that would be ideal Okay, let's see what we can find here. I need a fish. You're gonna have to swim out to sea and kill a fish. I like this tuna. I like the look of it. Alright, make sure we're not gonna get eaten by anything bigger. Swim back to shore. Um, Feral Thunder says, great, thanks for the update. I've been learning how to control with the PC slowly. So used to Arc Mobile. Yeah, it definitely takes some adjustment if you're not used to the PC. Luckily, PC is a pretty easy thing to get the hang of in the long run, I think. Um, and hey, once you've got the hang of that, maybe you'll even be able to play some uh, Atlas, because Atlas is pretty great as well. All right. Got to go cook my fish, guys. Wait, I'm actually going to kill another one, because I didn't get a ton of meat from that. Oh, I don't like the Manta. I really don't like the manta, but I need the fish. Come here. Sea bass. Okay. Let's swim back to shore quickly. Short path. Let's hope we don't get killed by the manta. The manta are especially evil. Luckily, we have a lot of oxygen on this game. It's nice. Uh, bye, Leah. Thanks so much for coming out and watching. Uh, oh, you'll get bullied at school if you don't get enough sleep. That's no fun. Um, I do hope you got some good sleep then. I'm doing good, Team 10 Wolf. How are you? Bright Diamond says, A week ago I saw a chicken cross the road for reals. Awesome. That actually sounds amazing. Uh, I would have loved to see that. This is a huge fish. Uh, you can have the rest of that if you want it. I'm good. I don't know if they can hear me. <laughs> Eh. Oh my goodness. Uh, they can cook their own for sure. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, I forgot I had fish cooked up already. Alright, there we go. Uh, that was a big fish anyway. Let's go ahead and cook stuff up. I don't like that I ca can't turn off the voice chat as far as I know. Eh. Alright. Let's do that, and let's eat some stuff. Uh, someone's on my island, Chase. Yes, I do know. Um, ugh. I need to, like, avoid people as much as possible when I'm playing on the public servers, because I don't like the voice chat, but, uh, there's really, I don't know if there's a way to turn it off. I've kind of, 
I've kind of played around with it and I can't see an option to disable it, um, which is frustrating because I don't like it. But that's why I'm interested in getting a private server for the game. I am looking into that and hopefully I'll get one soon that's up and running. All right. Okay, so, so far so good. I'm actually going to go ahead and stash a bunch of stuff because I've just got too much in terms of items. I have all of these berries that I just don't need. I can cook some of the meat as well. Oh my gosh, I haven't actually gotten that many resources, really. Uh, scales. I've been too distracted. And fleece. Alright. So then I still have some hide. I'm still good there. Um, I do need more keratin stuff. I do need to cook a few things. And then we should be all set. Hmm. Get all those over there. Yeah, I've got all my veggies. Um. <laughs> let's see. Jay the Destroyer says, Sorry, Nacho, I don't really know much what's a root trains is it time clock like thing oh uh i have no idea what that meant because i feel like i missed a lot of that conversation um <laughs> let's see here what level is your sheep my sheep is level 13 maybe 14 now it's not the highest level in the world all right i'm doing good i'm doing real good in terms of stuff oh man i like the little speed boost that jumping in gives you See, we have this adorable sheep. Uh, oh, it's level 14 now. It still can't carry us because we're heavy. Nope. I gotta, like, get just the right angle on the hill so that when I jump off, I don't glitch out. There we go. So, definitely still buggy, but we have our friendly little sheep here. I wish I could shear him for stuff. Uh, nope. So, these are very, very similar... Yeah, these are super similar to the Ark uh, creatures, as far as I can tell, but eh, they're still cool. I'm still happy to have it. I would like to tame a, a seagull, because I feel like those would be useful for fishing. Uh, feral Thunder says, I get annoyed at school because I do YouTube and the majority of kids there don't even know what feral means. Oh my goodness, feral means once domesticated, gone wild. It's great. I know what it means. I need this straw. Asmore says, could someone guess her real name? Uh, I seriously doubt someone could guess my real name. I'm like, I highly doubt it. Um, and even if you did, I probably would deny it because I am pretty big on keeping my privacy to myself. Like I don't super want my name out there in the world, uh, if at all possible. Eh. Uh, I like being the iguana. Being the iguana is pretty great. What a cute rabbit. It's gone now. Um, <laughs> uh, Flip says, so I just posted a report in your server. Or do I just wait? Uh, yes. Uh, if you posted a server report, one of the mods will be with you shortly, if not myself at some point. Um, it's probably going to be the mods, to be honest, because they usually have more time than I do for that kind of thing. But, yeah, it shouldn't be too long before someone comes along and helps you out uh, with that situation. All right. I feel like I want to use one of these treasure maps. Now, the problem is, is I don't have a shovel yet. So, I got to figure out how to get a shovel, guys. That's going to be the biggest issue. I feel like that's in construction somewhere. Okay, tannery. That's going to be important uh, for riding. Loom... Okay, I can use better quality tools and weapons. That's good. Um, amount of health repaired by a structure. I don't know. Okay, wooden. Okay, so that's going to be important. If you get to the secrets of building, you can get wooden structures. Gun mounts, wall hooks, uh, wood canvas training dummy. Okay. Forge. Okay, we're going to want the forge for sure. Ooh, seamanship. Uh, I feel like I'm just reading. Sorry, guys. Uh, 
Philip Masakoy, thank you so much for subbing and welcome to the stream. I'm just trying to figure out how to get a shovel on here. Like, can I get a basic shovel? Is Kazoo still in the chat? He might know. Because I have no idea where to get the shovel from. I feel like that's going to be an important skill. Oh, here! Advanced tools. Got it. Okay. And that's where you can get the sickle. Okay, so that's what we need to learn next. So I need to level up so that I can learn this advanced tool skill and make a smithy and do all of that. So we're going to hunt. We're going to go hunting, guys, so that we can level up. Because otherwise we will take forever to level. Can I... I don't like the equip cooldown. That's really weird. It's not good. It's not good at all. There we go. Okay, let's see if we can... Good. Okay, we got that. Can I get those arrows back? I would like the arrows back. Apparently I can't get the arrows back, but that's alright. I can make more. Oh, there, I got one. Um, <laughs> gotta repair that. <laughs> Nitro says, what a cute rabbit attacks. It's dead now. Iguana. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I, I need the XP. That's my, uh, that's my, de that's my defense for that. Rip and chat for the bunny. Yes. Uh, Ariana Fonner, uh, Fire says, hi, Iguana. Can you say hi, Nikki? My little bro's watching and he would love it. Hello, Nikki. Thank you so much for watching today. I hope you are having a fantastic day. I really do. All right. Let's see if we can kill this boar. There's two. Never mind. I need more straw and more arrows if I'm going to kill a boar. Uh, that's a bear. I don't like bears. Okay. Can we find something a little easier to kill that would still give decent XP. I don't want to kill the horse. I like horses. I like them a lot. There's a sheep. I can kill a sheep. I don't feel too bad killing sheep. All right, let's uh, get up here and that did nothing. It's sticking in your nose. Are you invincible? You have to hit the hit boxes just right. Oh no. Die. There we go. Alright. I think I got some arrows back. Oh, man. I only got a few arrows back. I'm down to five arrows, so I am going to have to craft more real soon, but at least we're getting some stuff done. Uh, <laughs> Feral Thunder says, if you were a warrior cat, I would name you Lizard Tail in honor of all iguanas. Aw, thank you, Feral Thunder. That is amazing. Vivek says... What's a lawless land, Iguana? Okay, so lawless land is area that has not been claimed. So um, basically, once you are out in the lawless land, you should be able to claim territory. So you should be able to, like, I don't know why that's working, but um, you should be able to actually place a flag and uh, claim some territory, which means other people can't build there. Uh, you can gain more XP, you can do um, actual taming. So if you're in a Freeport city, you can buy some things and you can gather some things and you can kill some things, but you can't tame anything, you can't really build, uh, you can't really do much. So going into the lawless land is super important in terms of like getting out into the game world and actually sailing uh, on the seas and going to new islands. So it's it's a little bit hard for me to explain, I guess, but uh, that is the idea. That is a wolf. All right, we probably could kill one wolf if it was a singular wolf. Yeah, it's just the one, but yeah, it's only level three. We could kill this wolf if we could get close enough to it without it attacking us. This is not going to end well. I can see this being the end of me. Especially since bows are not great with the hitboxes. Um, wolf's already... Nope. Totally missed. Not good. He's very focused on this crow. Okay. Hit him. Oh no, you're very strong. You are very strong. It's okay. It's okay. We're gonna get him. Nope. I'm gonna miss a lot. 
Okay. Okay, we did what we could. We're gonna have to chase him down. Uh, hopefully with a pick. I would like to get my arrows back. I'd like to just run up and rip my arrows out. Luckily, this is super buggy, so we can kind of just punch the wolf out. Yeah, I'm gonna kill you with a pick. That's gonna be a thing. It's, it's actually gonna happen. I'm not even hurt. I like it. I like it a lot. That worked super well. Stupid crow. Get out of here. This is my wolf now. Alright. <laughs> um, Bun, uh, you are a little bit late. We did sail out of the um, Freeport zone into the lawless land so we can now tame things. We can now do stuff. We did tame a sheep. Uh, I'm basically trying to go around killing a few things so that we can level up now. That is the basic goal today. How much is Atlas on Steam? Nitro. Atlas is currently around, um, what is it, 25-ish currency because it's an early access game. It's not actually that bad. So it's about 25 US dollars and it's... So it's, I don't think it's that expensive, at least not for me, um, for an early access game compared to ARC's like 60 now that it's out of early access. It's a level 19 sheep. A chicken! Guys, we're taming the chicken. Uh, I'm getting very distracted. Currently Atlas is on sale or it was on sale for 17% off, but now we have a chicken and we need to tame it. It's only level 10 though, and it's a male. I wish it was a female chicken. There's a chicken over there. Oh my gosh. We're going to tame the chicken. Even if it's just a male chicken. Male chickens aren't that great. I'm going to go check the level on that chicken in a minute. Once we get this one tamed up, we'll have a little flock. I need the eggs. Um, <laughs> Nicoloto Gaming says, Iguana, you are a big inspiration to me. I've never caught you on stream, so I just want to say you are amazing. Oh, thank you so much, Nicoloto. Uh, you are amazing. Thank you for watching the channel and supporting me, and I'm really glad you could make it out to the stream today. That's amazing. Um, <laughs> let's see here. Zanakul says, LOL. Uh, yeah, it's good. Bright Diamond says, have you died in this game yet? Um, I have died in this game when I first logged in. I logged into a lawless land. Uh, that's where I spawned in. And in the lawless land, it's very easy to get killed by like wolves and tigers and all sorts of nasty things. So I did die a couple of times to like giant cobras and a couple of tigers. But then I spawned into a um, free port and I have not died since. Uh, it's been close, but I don't think I've died since then. Uh, can you tame a wolf yet? Bun, uh, no, I do need to be able to craft a bola to do that. Uh, so I'm still only at taming level one and you need at least taming level two to, to tame most rideable creatures. Uh, I was able to tame a sheep, so that's a tier one creature and I can ride it now that I have that skill, but I am going to need to level up my beast mastery if I want to do all that. But first priority is getting a shovel because I need gold because I need crew members so that I can sail further without worrying too much about uh, manning the sails so much. Uh, Game Gamer, hello, welcome. How are you doing? <laughs> I know, I'm so excited that a chicken popped up. Chase says, I can afford it, but I have no computers, so... Yeah, it is unfortunate that it's only available on um, PC, at least at the moment. Oh, that's a male chicken too. I don't want that one. I want this one. I only wanted it if it was a female, but I'm going to keep this male chicken. It's going to go hang out with our sheep. <laughs> um, yeah, guys, everyone's so excited about the chicken. Uh, Alex, hello and welcome. Intense Gamer, did you miss anything? Uh, you missed us sailing across the sea and being very scared of a ghost ship and taming a sheep. And now you're catching us taming a chicken, so that's the important stuff. So you didn't miss too much. Uh, is this the true Lawless Land Atlas equals Redwoods of Ark? Um, I would say this is actually not so bad. So I, the original island that I spawned on, it was a Lawless Land, and it was horrible. There were, like, deadly things every two seconds. And so this is actually not bad because there are some angry creatures but they don't aggro very easily on you 
and they are pretty spread out, so it's not too hard to avoid them. Uh, so I actually don't think that it's it's as bad as it could be out here. We're getting very close to getting this chicken, and I'm very excited. I hope I can carry it. I really hope I can carry it. Hi, pig. Go away. Um... Leah says, can you tell me your server so I can give you a free griffin? Um, I am on a few servers at the moment. They're all unofficial servers. Uh, one of them is Iguana PvP, another one's Iguana PvE, and the other one is Iguana Rutrine PvX. So those are the free servers that I play on. I do have a Patreon server that I more often play on, but I do already have some pretty good griffins on there. But thank you, I would appreciate a griffin. Can you boost your Arc Mobile server at max? Um, live gaming, not sure what you mean by that. Um, most of the servers that I have for Arc Mobile are already boosted as much as I can do without breaking the game. Uh, so that's a thing. Uh, if you want like increased, um, they already have increased XP. They already have increased uh, harvest rates and breeding rates and all of that as well. So they are they are already pretty good. Um, Pepsin, yeet. There you go. Oh man, I'm so excited about this chicken. Tristan Dupre, you've been shouted out. <laughs> name it Gold, that's the name of one of my chickens. Uh, ooh, that's a good name for it. We do need some gold in the game, so we could name the chicken Gold and maybe it'll give us some luck. Got very distracted from my XP hunt because chicken. It wants to be my friend. Oh man, we're so close. I'm so excited about the chicken, guys. Nitro says, I really want to become a Patreon, but I'm 12, so I don't have my own credit card. Nitro, that is totally fine. Uh, I am willing to work with people who are too young for credit cards on the Patreon stuff. Um, if you have other ways to donate, uh, you can DM me on the Discord and we can work something out. Uh, the deal is basically it just has to be like that level of monthly donation before people can join the Patreon status. Uh, the Patreon is just an easy way to organize it all, but I do work with people individually on that. Uh, Nacho, you got the primal pass last night. You put the pass loop for this month and you accidentally clicked accept on a server instead of redeeming it in single player. Oh, my thumbs and arc. I was mad. <laughs> that is rough for sure, especially since it's got the griffin kibble in it. Oh, man. And the eerie turret, as far as I know, uh... That's useful because you can only get them in single player by redeeming that code. Like, you can't make eerie turrets in single player. Alpha Dog, welcome back. Name it Clucky or Golden Goose Egg. Nail Rocks 02, I can tell you what is Arc Atlas. So, this is Atlas. Uh, it's not the same as Arc. It is a different game, I promise. Name it Golden Macker. I like that name as well. Um. <laughs> Let's see here. Looking for the name suggestions again. Name it Gold. I do like Gold. Let's name it Gold Clucky. Golden Clucky. We'll combine some of the names. Winner Winner Chicken Dinner. That's also a great name for them. Come here. I have a chicken. I have a chicken. Life is complete. I have a chicken. All right, we're going to run this chicken back down to shore. Man, we run really, really weird when we've got a chicken in our hands. Um, I'm pretty sure we need to go this way. If I'm not mistaken, we need to go this way. I think. I think I'm on the right track. Yes, yes, that's the river. We're good. Um... Jay the Destroyer says, how do I DM you? I want to join you on your Patreon server. Uh, you can DM me on the Discord, so you will have to join the Discord for that. And then you can just find my name from the list of people and join that way. That is the best way to get a hold of me. Uh, sometimes it does take me a while to reply because I do have three jobs, so a little patience is appreciated. But usually within a day or two, I've got everybody sorted out and playing. Uh, Nail Rex, I unfortunately cannot do a face reveal for work reasons, um, but I do plan to eventually someday. It's just going to be quite a long time. I wouldn't expect it anytime soon. Uh, thank you, Nacho, for posting that uh, Discord link. That was very helpful. How did the chicken taming start working? It wasn't working before. Ariana Fire. So the chickens, and any tame actually, 
you can only tame if you're in the lawless land. You cannot tame if you're in a Freeport server. So I had to leave the area of the map that I was on and go to what is called a lawless land. It is really dark right now. Um, and so when I did that, I was able to start taming. So now I can tame things. It is very nice because I desperately wanted a chicken. It's annoying because you can feed creatures, but they don't actually tame up while you're in a free port. So that's pretty awful. I also wish I could run a little faster with this chicken. That would be nice. He's going to go hang out with our sheep friend down here. And then we're eventually going to get the SS Toast a little closer and load up these guys uh, if we can before we move on. But I think I'm going to be on this island for a while, actually. Okay, just the controls are very similar to ARC. I can't give commands yet, but I can... Uh, okay, did disable following. Good. I have a chicken. I have a chicken and it's beautiful. And he's going to get all of the berries because he's a beautiful chicken. And he earned them. He did. And you can have some more chamomile. Actually, you have tons. You're good. All right. I've got my little farm here. I don't have any place to put them yet, but I do have a farm going. Um, okay, so now the goal was actually to get some XP, which I totally got distracted from. Hello, pony. How do I tame you? Oh, it said it there briefly. It said it briefly. I need a bola. Okay. So I do need to get a tannery going. That's a bear. That's a bear. Hi, bear. You shouldn't go down there, bear. You should not. I'm afraid of the bear. I need some more fiber. Let's get some more fiber. I feel like I need to kill that bear, but I need to make more arrows to do that. Uh, let's go ahead and make as many arrows as we can. All right, and then maybe we can climb up on, uh, climb up on a good little cliff area here. And then hopefully the bear can't climb up here after us. Oh no. Okay, okay, we did some damage. Good. No, don't climb up here. Don't climb up here. I'm gonna kill this bear. It's gonna be okay. It takes it a second for the health to register. I missed. Yes. Okay, we killed the bear. We got some good XP off of that. Uh, hopefully we'll get some more good bones and such because bones are like a carotenoid, so I can use those to build a tannery. That's the wrong item. Pepjin says, I raised my chicken gold from when he was born. Awesome, Pepjin. That is awesome. That's actually really adorable to have like a tiny little baby chicken that you've raised from birth. It's pretty amazing. All right. Uh, I wasn't even paying attention. Okay, so we did get tons of bones from that. That's awesome. And I did get the water, so we should be okay now. I'm gonna eat a little bit. All right. Okay, so I ate some berries, I ate some veggies, ate some fish, ate some meat. We're good. Maybe let's go cook some stuff. Eh. It's a little hard to get up on the raft when it's out at sea, but can manage. Can kind of manage. All right. Got that. Um, I can drop some more fleece. I think that's in the other one. We can actually cook a little more because I had like a ton of stuff in here. Oh my gosh. I have so much meat. So, so much meat. It's crazy. I don't think I'm going to run out of food anytime soon, guys. Uh, I need wood. Do I need more wood? I do need more wood. I'm going to have to go hit some trees. Um, in the meantime, I guess I'll burn that. Might as well keep everything kind of cooking up. All right, let's go hit a tree. Uh, we're very close to that next level, and then we should be able to craft the shovel, and then we can go look for gold, guys. I'm excited about that. Oh, man. We're getting stuff done this stream. I feel like we're doing good. Sammy UB says, what PC are you using? I am using, um, it's kind of a custom built PC, but I didn't build it myself, so it's a little hard to explain. 
but it does have some pretty good specs on it. It's got like 24 gigs of RAM, um, an i7 processor, which is okay. It could use an upgrade some at some point here. And then I do have a 2080 Ti Founders Edition graphics card. So my graphics are actually pretty amazing. Uh, at least on my end, they don't always translate well to YouTube, but I do have good graphics. To Potato Dragon says, I like your galley and a type of boat in Atlas that's expensive. Oh, I, I would love to get um, a galleon. I'm going to need a lot more crew members for that, for sure. I'm going to have to hire a lot of people. Um, <laughs> yeah, now rocks. I am 27. There we go. Tyler says, PvP is too rough right now, it seems like. I would not be surprised with how many bugs are in the game. Even PvE is a little bit PvP-ish, because you can actually, if you don't pin code your boxes, it's possible for people to steal your stuff, which is super fun. Uh, definitely don't like that, but it is what it is. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's super frustrating, I can't lie. Um... Let's see if I can eat some more of this aloe stuff, and then we'll put the chamomile on there. I need to just, like, have all these veggies and things. I would like to learn the cooking skill soon, because I bet cooking makes the food management a lot easier as well. But it's really fun so far. Like, I'm really enjoying even, like, once you get the hang of it, it's not too bad. You just have to keep a lot of different types of food on you. But none of them are particularly hard to get, which is pretty good. All right, let's uh, let's drop some of that wood in here, relight that fire, get all of the fish and meat cooking up, and feeling pretty good. All right, now that it's evening, we've got a chicken, we've got a sheep. We're doing good. Um, okay, we need about 25 more XP to get to level 9 so that we can get ourselves into the skill tree and learn these advanced tools, because I need a shovel. I really need a shovel. Ooh, and a spyglass would be great. A lantern would be amazing. I just need all the things. I need literally all of the things, so we're going to have to go hunting. The bear helped a lot, so hopefully we can kill a few more creatures like that. Uh, I would like to kill the seagull. I don't think the bow is going to work very well on the seagull when it does its little spinny thing. No, that's not going to work. Um, dang it, I didn't want to fire that. Um, what laptop would I recommend for gaming? Elfie, the best one you can get. Uh, laptops are not great for gaming games like Atlas and Ark. It can actually... I've, I've heard horror stories about, like, laptops catching on fire trying to play these games because they just weren't spec'd right or they didn't have enough cooling. Uh, so if you are going to get a laptop, I highly recommend getting one with um, at least like a 1000 level graphics card, maybe a 1060 minimum. Um, getting one with a really big SSD so that everything boots up and making sure you get one that has good cooling. That is the most important thing and it's the thing that no laptop like talks about. So either you have to get one with good cooling or you have to come up with a really good way to cool the laptop externally, which can be very difficult. Um, whenever possible for gaming, I highly recommend people go PC instead of laptop. But if you are set on a laptop, uh, just make sure it's a good one. Um, and a good gaming one will usually run you around twelve to $1,500 at minimum. Uh, just be aware. They are pretty pricey. All right. There are a couple of pigs here. I would like to take those. Oh, there's bear. There's bear. I can take bears down. The problem is... Ooh, wait. There's a cliff. Um, I'm, I'm afraid of the bear. I'm really afraid of the bear. I hope this is a low level. Oh, be stuck. Be stuck. Being stuck is amazing. I love bugs. This bug makes me happy. I'm okay with it. <laughs> okay. Oh, I like when things can't actually get around. I'm going to get as many of my arrows back as I can because they're kind of pricey to craft. There we go. <laughs> um, Tyler says, you can hire me to be your crew. Oh, thank you. 
If you actually can find me on this server, I would actually do that, because I could definitely use some crew. Uh, it would be pretty amazing. <laughs> the Potato Dragon says, my quality is 1080p, but the stream looks so bad. Um, that might also be YouTube settings, guys. I do apologize. YouTube has had some hiccups in, like, resetting all of my stream information lately, and so... Some of the stream quality might actually be YouTube reset what my stream options were. Um, I would have to double check that, but I hope that it will all be fixed for next time. I did try to fix it for this one and it just reset everything immediately once I started the stream. So there are a lot of bugs with it and I do apologize for any misinformation or anything that could be an issue here. All right. So we're getting close. That bear helped a lot in terms of XP. We got about 10 XP. That's garbage. Um, I think I'm going to have to kill the pigs, but the pigs are scary. They're so fast. And I need more arrows. Let's make all of those. Am I hungry? How am I hungry? All right. All right. We're going to eat two of everything. think ish we'll get there another fish looks good the chamomile looks good um i need more orange stuff so we'll eat some more berries now we need more yellow stuff let's eat a little more of that all right it's so tricky because you have to balance what you eat <laughs> uh there we go i should be okay more berries there we go. Okay. Should be okay now. Uh, what games are my favorite? Game Gamer, I actually really love... Um, I really love playing Ark, especially, and then Atlas now is pretty amazing as well. I'm having a lot of fun with that. I don't want to mess with the bee, because I need a spear for the bees. Oh gosh, bees. Bees suck. Oh, come on, let me pull it out. I'm gonna have to punch a bee to death. I don't see how this is gonna go well. This is not gonna go well. Okay, there we go. There. Ugh. Bees are annoying. I wish I could find the body and, like, pull honey off of it. That would be really useful. Oh, a bear. Maybe we can go kill that bear. I bet we could kill that bear. We can probably lure it to a cliff. Um, ooh, a catfish. It's a little terrifying. Okay, there's some good fish in the rivers here. I guess that shouldn't surprise me. <laughs> um, can I sing the Megalovania theme song just to weep, please? I actually don't know it, otherwise I probably still wouldn't because I don't like singing. Um, but could probably be talked into it under the right circumstances. Alright, I'm gonna kill this bear. It's going to be a thing, guys. We're basically bear hunting to gain levels. Ah, and I can't pull out my bow. Which means that we might actually... If we can't get the angle right here, this bear will kill us. I only have eight arrows. Um, luckily, bears are a little bit... Oh, yes, you're stuck on the trees. I like that. Stay there. Yeah, stay down there. That's good. I like it when you're stuck. Um, I can't see you. There you go. I can't see you again. Ouch! I didn't know you could reach me. No. Oh, that was a waste. Okay. There we go. See you. Come on. Come out where I can see you. There we go. No, no, no. Nope, nope. Got it. Just in time. Because I totally ran out of arrows. Alright, got the bear. Let's go ahead and harvest this guy up. Only got one arrow back, but uh, at least we did that. If I die, I sing. That's fair. I think that's fair. If I can stay alive, I don't have to do this. Why are there catfish everywhere? Oh, heck. Okay, let's not mess with those. Um... What do I need? I need fiber and flint. Oh, man. 
It's always with the fiber. Oh, I got iron. I think that's a metal. All right, let's repair that and let's repair that. Oh, wait, no, I need fiber still. Dang it. Fiber. Is there anything that resembles fiber around here? Please, straw. Yes. These plants give straw. Let me go pick all of them. Um, bye, Johnny Brunton. Thanks so much for coming out and watching today. Oof, 3% on a laptop. That's rough. Um, Orange Juice says, Iguana, can you tame a wolf, please? I would actually love to tame a wolf. I don't think we're quite there in terms of materials yet. I still need to get the tannery made up um, and get that tier 2 taming. Once we do that, I should be in a pretty good position to tame um, quite a few creatures, preferably wolves. We'll see. I would really like to tame some of those and have them around with us. It would be nice to have them. I can't lie. Um, I don't know if we'll get to it this stream, but I will definitely, definitely get one going at some point for sure. All right. And we are so, so close. Uh... Bun, I killed Timmy the little bee boy because the little bee boy was trying to sting me to death. And so I had to kill the bee. I'm very sorry. It just needed to be done. It was a thing. Um, catfish are terrifying. I wonder if I could kill them with a spear. I wanted the bear body, but I think they've, like, done their thing. Uh, there's sea bass in the river. That's interesting. Level 26. I like a level 26. Can I reach? Nope. My spear broke. Good stuff. Let's make another one. Um, Alpha Dog, welcome back. Uh, Bright Diamond says, I have to go. I'll be back soon if the stream is still on. Uh, Alright, Bright Diamond, thanks for coming out. I do hope you make it back. Uh, cowgirl, what's my objective currently? I need to level up so that I can make a shovel so that I can go and dig for treasure. That's literally the whole goal. Um, is not an easy goal. Is very not an easy goal. There's a lot of catfish here. I'm afraid. I'm very afraid. <laughs> I killed, like, a little catfish. So, I basically have been killing bears. I've been, um killing fish. I've basically been killing anything that I think might give me XP uh, because I do I do need the levels, so um, no, come here. I'll take the fish meat. Vitamin D is good. Which sound, which is better to you, Tap Ajara or Atera in Ark? Um, I like Taps. They're a little bit slower, but they do um, have a little bit more, like, maneuverability and so I actually do prefer Tapajaras. Alright. Fish are not going to get me there. I'm really, really close to that level, guys. Look how close we are. Actually, fish might get me there. I'm torn between trying to kill a fish and trying to kill something bigger. Um, let's see what there is. Let's see. we got to go all the way around. Man, I wish I could turn off the global chat. Man, people have these cute little houses all built up. I'm like, I'm not about that yet. I want to, uh, I want to sail a little further and explore a little bit more. I think that'd be good. I think I see a rabbit. Uh, that leveled me up. I feel bad. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But I got the level. Uh, let's see here. I hope you get the shovel. Oh, thank you, Nitro. Uh, Eliel Barranco says, can you fight the boss gorilla? Um, is there a boss gorilla on, on Atlas right now? I didn't know that there was. I don't know very much about the game. I haven't been doing too much with it. All right, let's go ahead and do fortitude again. Ah, oh, advanced tools. Wait, what? I need eight skill points for that? That's insane! Oh my goodness. Eight skill points. Okay, so I need to level up like three more times before we can get a shovel. That's fun. Uh, I guess we're just gonna be doing a heck of a lot of like murdering things and probably crafting at some point if we can. 
Come here, seagull. I can't hit the seagull. It's flapping around. I should have hit it when it was on the land. Are you attacking me? Uh, yeah, it's attacking me now. There we go. Got the seagull down. Uh, that one's coming at me. Alright. That's frustrating, because I really needed a sickle, and I really needed a shovel. So I guess what I'm going to do is craft, like, a whole bunch of weapons and just go out and try to, um, basically kill everything that I can, because that's the only way I know to level up quickly on the atlas so far. Alright. Come here, I dare you. Okay, he left us alone. Cool. So we're gonna head back across the river. There were a couple of pigs over there. We may be able to equip the bow. Oh my goodness. This game is so grindy. Um, I could probably craft up a few more things. That might help with the XP gain, but it is painfully slow. Like this, this game is designed to take hours and hours and hours to do anything. Uh, so it is a little bit difficult. At least we're near fresh water though. And we do have a chicken, even if it's not a female. Uh, is it eventually possible to build big ships? Ariana Fire, yes, it absolutely is. Now, the problem that I've heard with that is that one of the good ships on the game um, takes something like 12 real-time hours to build, which is an insane amount. Like, that is really, really long. Uh, so we may have some issues in terms of getting that done, but... Uh, Hopefully, eventually, we'll be able to build a ship. It'll be easier if I can, like, team up with somebody at some point. Um, some other content creators join a server with some people or maybe get some patrons playing. Uh, that would be good. And then we can hopefully, eventually, get some actual progress made. Plus, if I did do that, I would raise the XP gain on a server because this is, like, absurdly slow. I cannot lie. Uh, hi, Labrador Gaming. How's it going? Um... Jose says, uh, Iguana, can you read this comment, please? I have eight chickens, I know, right? And raise them all the same. Snuggles, food, water, and fun games. Now my two adult males hate me, which is sad. I miss my babies. Aw, that is the worst. I'm so sorry to hear that. It's always sad when the babies grow up and, like, no longer care or, or are, like, afraid of you. That's always sad, too. All right, I'm going to equip my bow. We're going to try to kill a pig. We gotta do it. Uh, my bow is still in sh good shape, but I do need more arrows. I need more flint. Let's go smack a rock. Oh my goodness. That's a bear. Not a rock. Hooy. Okay. Scared me for a minute there. Um, can I find a rock? I can find this rock. It's not much of a rock. It's not enough flint. Might have to make my way back to that center area where there were a ton of rocks. Uh, Alpha Dux, let's see if the stream is still on in 15 minutes. Uh, should be. I think we'll still be going live for at least another half hour here. I'm having way too much fun to, uh, to quit now, for sure. <laughs> uh, Max Copo says, hashtag painfully slow. Yes, it is incredibly painfully slow. Fire YouTube says, OMG Iguana, I'm finally on your stream. Welcome, Fire. Glad you could make it out for this stream. Oh my goodness. That is awesome. Bears need honey to tame. I'm not surprised by that. Uh, I'm going to have to figure out where to get the honey. Um, I'm not too worried about trying to tame those just yet because I don't even have the tier 2 taming. I'm trying to save my skill points right now to get the smithy and the other tools because I do need them. Pixel animations, hello and welcome. Iguana, what should I tame? A sarco or a beaver? Uh, beavers can harvest wood, but sarcos are faster in water a little bit. I would tame the beaver. You know, I just would. I would tame the beaver. Let's get some stamina back. I'm gonna raise my torpor. <sighs> um, one person to feel bad, one step to me feeling better. Jose, that's kind of like vicious right there. It's a little bit cruel. All right, let's raise some uh, food levels here. 
And we should be good once I've got all that food up. Beautiful. Okay. So we did the flint thing. And we need fiber. Oh my gosh, fiber. Uh, fiber. Oh, these plants. These plants get fiber. Okay. There we go. Let's get a little straw. Oh my goodness. Fiber was much easier to come by in the Freeport. I am realizing that. I should have definitely packed more in my boxes. Um, Area Finder says, this part of the map is beautiful. It is absolutely gorgeous. Like, look at this. Uh, you have this lovely valley next to, like, this giant mountain way off there in the distance. Um, you have, like, this view over the sea. Um, I actually have seen areas very much like this uh, in the area that I'm originally from. It's kind of cool that it looks a little bit like home to me. Tanaka bear, you need a tannery to craft bulla. You can only bulla bear when it's on low health. Ooh, thank you for the tip, uh, Labrador. Yeah, I thought that might be the case to, um, to have to, like, I thought you might have to weaken them, so it feels a little bit like maybe a Pokemon game, uh, where you have to, like, weaken them before you can tame them. I want a crow. That's a pretty crow. This crow's gonna die. Or not. There we go. Uh, let's switch tools. There we go. Get my arrows back. I would like to get a crow. I really would. Um, okay, more fiber. I'm looking for more of those tall scrub plants. There's one. It's the only way I know to get fiber right now. Travis says, cooking system. Yes, the cooking system would be incredibly useful for sure. Um, I do want to learn all of that. The issue is, is that I need the smithy so that I can get gold. Like, I have to be able to make a shovel so that I can get gold and hire crew members because right now I am solo and I need NPC crew members to make sailing a little bit easier. So, the goal is to go treasure hunting, uh, basically by the next stream. So I'm going to have to do a lot of grinding though, because I need at least three more levels to get there because you only get two skill points per level, which is insanely low. And it takes forever to level up. Like I'm only level nine right now and I've got just such a long way to go. I might be able to kill that bear once we get enough arrows here. Oh yeah, there we go. Just put a lot of effort into these arrows. And then let's hop up here. Oh yeah, that's a good cliff. That's a very good cliff. Let's kill the bear. I feel like bears are good XP. Can I hit you in the head? I feel like it should do more damage in the head. Uh, don't move too much. Don't move too much. No, 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 hold still. That missed completely. Oh no! Why are you running? He's running. He's totally running! What the heck? Come back! Bear! Bear, no, you shouldn't be that fast! Oh my gosh, I'm gonna like charge up to you. And smack you with an arrow. No, 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 you're not allowed to heal. There we go. Got it. Ugh. Hunting? Kind of a problem. Give me that arrow. Arrow. I want all the arrows back. There we go. I got some of them back anyway. Um, Cowgirl says, I hope you get a crow. They look so cute. They really are. I want like a crow and a parrot. I want all the shoulder mounts, I think. Uh, that would be amazing. Unfortunately, it takes like absolutely forever to get anything done on here. Um, okay, let's go ahead and check out what we have. We've got lots of carotenoids. So, what all can I even make? Is this everything I can make? A generic saddle. Okay, so I need the tannery, but I don't think I have the skill to make the tannery yet. I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, I could make the tannery, but I don't, um, I don't really want to use the skill points on it because I really wanted this advanced tools option. 
since I have this, I now need this. Uh, urgh, it's a problem. It is a huge problem. Like, I could use those skill points now, and I could be using them to make other things. And I do think I actually might have almost enough stuff to make that. I need... I think I need more metal is the issue to make the tannery. Um, but we could probably get metal. It could be a thing. Apes Shah says, ask Mental to join you. I would, but his laptop is, like, not capable of running this. It, like, struggles to run... Um, even, like, normal games, like Overwatch, he struggles to run that. <gasps> oh, no, it's a male chicken. Um, I don't want to use my arrows. I really don't. I want to use my spear. Let's use my spear. I'm going to kill the chicken. Just so everyone's warned, I'm going to kill this chicken because I don't need it. It is not a good chicken. It's not a female chicken, so it doesn't get to live with us. I feel a little bad. Um, is there an ETA for Atlas on Xbox for 2019? Uh, JV, I don't think so. It is still an early access game on PC, so I doubt that it will be coming to console um, anytime soon. They usually do that port once the game is fully released, unfortunately, so that could take quite a while, um, as far as I know. I need to get more metal, guys. Uh, Fire YouTube says, hooray, I just hit three subs. <laughs> Congrats on three subs. Uh, Feral Thunder says, If you could be any dino in Extinction, excluding Iguanagon, Iguanodons and Carnos, what would you be? In Extinction, I would be... I would be a Monogamer, because they're amazing. They are really, really cool. Uh, is there an ability that's like shield piercing? I think it can, and it can do over 100 damage. That would be awesome. I'd be very excited if I could do over 100 damage. Can't lie. Alright, I'm just gonna, like, craft a bunch of stuff because that's the only way I know to do things. Um, yeah. I mean, we could craft a paintbrush. I don't see the point in it, but we could. Alright, what do we need? We need fiber. Always fiber. I don't... I don't like that we always need fiber. It's the worst part of crafting. It's the limiting factor here for sure. Ugh. And you only get like four of it per bush. It's terrible. It's honestly terrible. All right, let's go swim out to the raft and do a little bit of inventory management because I kind of have a lot of items and I just want to sort them all out. Bun says, how do I become a Guana Gaming just like you? Um... Uh, I don't know, because I don't even really know how I became me, honestly. How I got to be Iguana Gaming here. Just kind of chose a name. It was actually a name that a lot of other people had already. And for some reason it just worked for me. But, yeah, I don't know, guys. <laughs> Kelly Flanagan says, need to craft a deep fryer for that chicken and some buffalo sauce. That would actually be great. I would love that. Okay, so far so good. All right, let's throw some bones in there. So we have a ton of them. All right, we also have a ton of like flint resources, which is good, and some fleece, which we don't need. I've been skinning a lot of things, so we can put that away. Um, tons of celery, tons of meat, not very much in the way of straw, but we do have quite a bit of granite now, so we can put that away. And slate. We'll put the slate away. Uh, and then we probably need that. Alright, I feel like I need to organize everything. Let's put all of the maps together. Like, yeah, together, together. Okay. Um, tons of thatch. Uh, tons of fish oil. I think we have fish oil. We can, yeah, we can throw the fish oil in there. Got tons of pelt. Let's see. There's a skill in archery that does 246 damage if you land it. It's called piercing shot. Ooh, Travis, that's one I definitely need. Um, Ariana Fire says, did you ever play Super Mario 64 or any Mario games? Actually, yes. I actually still own Super Mario 64, and it is a fantastic game that I enjoy very, very much. Uh, I love that game. 
I still have it, and I haven't played it in a while, but I could probably still play it, actually, because I do still have it, now that I think about it. It's a possibility. Don't have a way to play it on the channel, though. I think it would be hard to hook up. All right, so that's some inventory management. <sighs> okay. No more fish here, but there are plenty of fish on the rivers. All right, let's run up this way. Um, yep, gonna kill a seagull. Yep, gonna kill this seagull too. Come here. I missed. I missed. I'm terrible. I'm a terrible shot with the spear. I can't hit it at all. There we go. I hit it once. It wants to hit me, so I'm gonna kill it first. Come here. Oh my goodness. Uh, Rubber Buns, thank you so much for subbing and welcome to the channel. I do hope you're enjoying today. It would be good if I could kill this stupid seagull. It regened all its health. It's ridiculous. There needs to be a way to just, like, jab. Without, like, flipping the spear around, because that is what's happening. Oh, I see. I see. There is a way to jab. It's just really annoying. Alright, well, this seagull's never going to leave me alone, and I'm never going to be able to hit it with this stupid spear. Um... Chase says, is there a new patron? Yes, there is a new patron in the channel. I actually have a couple of new patrons in the channel. We usually get a couple, a couple like, every week or so. Um, people kind of rotate in and out. All right, here we go. Fire says, Taming a Dire is annoying. I always find low-level ones. Yeah, it's hard to get a good high-level Dire Bear for sure. Seagull, can you just not... I know I killed your friend, but you're, like, hard to hit. Their hitboxes are so bad. There we go. They hit me. Did you de-aggro? You de -aggroed. You're terrible. No. Nope. Missed. Ugh, stupid spear breaking. Causes all of the issues when the spears break. Can I make another one yet? I think I need more straw or possibly flint. I might need more flint for a spear. Fiber. No, it's fiber. It's always fiber. I had it. I almost had it. <laughs> uh, Kelly Flanagan and Travis Middleton, thank you so much for subscribing and welcome to the channel. I do hope you're enjoying. Hold left alt to get aim assist. Uh, oh, that's nice. Let's craft a spear, shall we? Ugh, I can't even equip it. That's so buggy. I don't like that. You should be able to equip it as soon as you craft it. Otherwise, you're going to get killed. Uh, there we go. Alright, aim assist. Oh boy. Uh, I feel like this doesn't work either. Definitely doesn't help. Does not help. Okay. Seagull is being horrible. Alright, this aim assist is not very good. Like, it's just not helping. <laughs> I had better luck, like, attacking it uh, in my own way. That's alright. We'll just ignore it. It's not doing a whole lot of damage. It's not really bugging me. All right, let's run over this way. Um, I do need, like, metal and stuff. I'm debating between trying to build the tannery and trying to just kill more creatures. Uh, dead wolf. Dead wolf. Uh, please make a video on how to find a unicorn. Master Neko, um, I did already make a unicorn video. The thing is, is that you cannot, there's not, like, a specific place to find a unicorn um, they have a random chance to spawn anywhere on the map so be aware of that is that um, it's not going to be easy 
to find a unicorn. Like, it, it could be anywhere on the land. And so me making a video about it would me just be saying, hey, you can find a unicorn anywhere. And uh, that wouldn't be a super entertaining one. I think. But that is me. Oh, don't hit me! Don't... Ah, you're huge! You're huge! Oh my gosh. Okay. Got the bear. Didn't hurt. Didn't hurt! <laughs> it was a pretty bear, too. I feel kind of bad. I feel super bad. Uh... Data is cool. Thank you so much for the super chat. Uh, he says, hey, Iguana, how are you? I love your content, by the way. I am doing pretty good here today. Uh, just kind of getting comfy with the grind. And hey, Retreen, how's it going as well? Uh, Jave Robbins, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the channel. Oh my gosh, all the people popping in now. Welcome, everyone, and thank you so, so much for coming to the channel, supporting the channel. You are all super appreciated here. Uh, okay, so we killed the bear. Ugh. The XP grind makes me insane. It's so slow. Like, we've gained maybe 30 points. Ugh. Bears need to be worth more. Especially with, like, how rare creatures are in general. Bears need to be worth more. Um. Alright. And we can't even craft that much in terms of stuff. Because the fiber is so, so limiting on what we can craft. Uh, oh, you mean where did Atag and you find the unicorn? Um, so Atag, uh, I actually think Golden Ash found that unicorn. One of my patrons found the unicorn. Atag brought it back to her base for me to tame. Um, but she found it, it, yeah, Golden Ash found it at the edge of the snow biome, right behind the, um, the volcano. So that kind of line where the biomes meet up, that is where that unicorn was found as far as I know. Um, the other ones have been found in weird places. I've heard them being found near the Green Obelisk. I've heard of them being found on Carno Island. Um, they've, they can pop up literally anywhere, but the, the one that I know about was found on the edge of the snow biome. Uh, what tames do I have? Orange juice. I have a sheep and I have a chicken, both male. I'm looking for a female chicken. If one ever pops up, I will tame it. And I'm kind of just looking around looking for stuff to kill because I don't have too much in the way of crafting skills yet. And I really need to uh, level up. And so killing stuff is the fastest way to level up. But uh, it's frustrating. I do like the bow. The bow is pretty good. It doesn't always hit like it should. The hitboxes are weird, but um, it does at least work. Now the issue is finding enough fiber to keep making the arrows because the arrows are very, very expensive in terms of fiber. Three fiber per arrow and there's just not a lot of fiber in this part of the map. Oh, we're next to the mountain thing. Cool. All right, uh, are any of these metal rocks? Because I need metal. I would like metal too. If I could find metal, I could make a tannery and then we could at least make a saddle for something and maybe try to read. I mean, ride something. Oh my gosh, read. Ugh. The words are going. Um, there's Chipotle talk in the chat and I feel like Rutrine is about to go get dinner. Uh, Ted Pye, thank you so much for subbing. Welcome to the channel. I do hope that you are enjoying. You have been shouted out. Uh, Alpha Dog says unicorns are unihorns. Pretty much. That is that is a good point. Uh, Jax Harrison says I'm not a big fan of Atlas, but since you're playing, I like it. Aw, thank you. I'm actually having a lot of fun with it. Um, the only issue is that I'm a little frustrated by the grind at times. But it is getting better. Like the The more I learn about it, the faster I'm able to do things and to level up. And I do like the exploring aspect of it. The problem is, is that you have to stop for so long to like level up that you can't just keep exploring endlessly, which is uh, a little frustrating right now, but that's all right. We'll get there eventually. I do feel like maybe I should have invested into base building because then I could craft things to gain XP. I would hope that that works. Yeah, because in the meantime, I'm kind of stuck just making the basics and the basics don't give you a whole lot of XP in terms of uh, gain. It's mostly passive XP that I'm getting right now. 
Nathan says, I got a PS4 for Christmas. I'm so happy. Congrats. Oh my goodness. That is amazing. PS4 is pretty good uh, Christmas haul there. All right. Um, oh, wow. I have a vitamin equilibrium boost. Let's, uh, let's keep that up. All right. I think I need a little more of those. I'm going to eat one fish, one meat. And a couple more of those and a couple more veggies. We should be good. I didn't realize I had a vitamin equilibrium boost. That is awesome. Data is cool. Thank you so much for the super chat again. Uh, he says, I ate unicorn poo and it's pretty cool to be honest. <laughs> yeah, the unicorn poo on uh, Arc Mobile is amazing. I can't lie. I love the effect on the screen. It does get old very quickly. So I think it lasts like a minute too long, but it is very cool. Crows are always trying to dive bomb people. Oof. Yeah, I'm not shocked by that. I think we can kill this pig. I think we can kill this pig. Or not, because the pig's invincible. There we go. Give me back my arrows. You got a couple of them back. Cool. Kill the pig. Feel good about that. All right, I need some more veggies. I got to keep my vitamin equilibrium balanced. Um, oh no, <laughs> official Jerboa is in the chat. Welcome, official Jerboa. Um, look away, look away. There are cute little bunnies on this game and they look somewhat Jerboa-like. They might be a distant cousin and you might not want to see what I do to them. <laughs> uh, pony, I want a pony so bad. Oh, that would be nice. Soon, soon, guys. Uh, let's see here. Nitro says, I personally hate Atlas, but I still watch the streams to try to support you as much as I can. Oh, thank you. Uh, actually, I am very curious. Why do you guys hate Atlas? Um, for everyone who's, like, strongly opposed to it, why are you so strongly opposed to it? Um, I am curious to hear your thoughts on the game. And then for the people who do like it, why do you like it? Like, what, what do you enjoy about it? Uh, cause I'm having fun playing it, but I could see from a viewer standpoint, it might not be that great cause it's so grindy, but from a playing standpoint, it's awesome. And I could see like the ghost ships and stuff being really cool incidents, um, for, for content, but the actual grind, this early part is just, it's rough. It's really rough. Um, you're welcome, Official Jabo. I'm glad I could give you a warm welcome. I'm really happy I found a bunch of fiber plants right here, so I'm just going to hang out and pick all the straw for a little minute. A little minute. I don't know. A little bit. A minute. I combine the two. Ugh. Ranch Juice says, can you tame a wolf? Uh, I don't have the skills to tame a wolf yet. I would love to be able to, but I do need to increase my taming stuff before I can do that. So I do, unfortunately, need more XP for that. Um... When can I get back on Extinction? It's been like two weeks. Uh, hopefully soon. I got distracted because Atlas came out and I wanted to spend some time playing that. I really wanted to make some progress on the game. Um, so I'm hoping to get back to Extinction soon, but it probably won't be until next week, to be honest. I do have a couple more things going on this week that I need to handle, but then next week we should be back to our regular uh, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday stream schedule, I'm hoping. If all goes well, we'll be able to do that for a week before the jobs get crazy again. Um, yeah, so it's going to be a thing. Uh, Atex says the video quality is bad. Uh, I think that's YouTube's problem, not Atlas's problem. It's buggy. Yes, it is buggy for sure. Uh, Alpha Doug says I hate it because it's arc reskinned and I like it because it's cool. Yeah, I could see how people would think it's... It's very arc-like in terms of mechanics, but there are... I, I would still say that playing it, there are enough differences that it doesn't bother me, and it actually is helpful that the key bindings are very similar because it means that it's a lot easier to pick up on the controls, at least for someone who's played PC Arc. It has good creatures. It does have good creatures. They're really cool. Atlas will be better once they add more content better than Arc for sure. Awesome. Thank you for your input, Kelly. I actually think it is going to be a big thing. It's ambitious with the MMO. I can imagine it's going to be pretty uh, laggy and crashy if you get some big sea battles going on, but I think it, it's going to be amazing. 
Um, let's see. How long do you go live? I usually stream for about three hours, which we are getting pretty close to that uh, three-hour mark here, unfortunately. So I was going to go and see if I could find... Uh, I would really like to find a metal rock, and if I can't find a metal rock, then I will just uh, let it go. But, ooh, there's a wolf. There's a wolf. Uh, can't tame it. Can't tame it. Might be able to kill it. Nope. I don't want to hit the... No. No! You hurt! You hurt! You hurt me. I don't like it. Go away. Yeah, run off the edge. Run off the edge of the rock. No, I'm missing. Oh, this is bad. I only have, like, two arrows left. Um. Uh, 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 uh. Don't, don't want to hit the horse. Don't want to miss. Got it. Okay. Oh. All right. I don't like that the wolves basically fall inside stuff. That's not good. Can I drag you? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to grab my arrows off of you, and then I'm going to chop you up. Did manage to kill a wolf. That's good. <laughs> um... <laughs> Let's see here. Nacho says, so Iguana, when do you think you will have the stream of Taming the Titan? I don't think that's going to be a stream. I think that's going to be a video. And actually, I think that should be coming up within the next week here. That'll actually probably be a video that comes out uh, sometime during next week. Because I do have a plan to get the saddle. Like, that's already sorted. The issue is going to be now that I need to... Um, actually just go and do the titan taming and that's pretty labor intensive that can take a while so uh, I figured I would wait until I actually had time to do that next week before I got that video out but uh, it is coming and it is coming within like two weeks so keep an eye out for it uh, Cody thank you so much that is very appreciated uh, that's Cody cares thank you uh, would you say Atlas could work like Eve online with how open and player influenced as Atlas could be um I don't know. I haven't played EVE Online, so I would imagine it's probably very similar in terms of, like, being able to kind of control the tone of the game. And basically, it's all about, like, whether players are going to be... Whether players are going to be good or bad that make this game sink or swim. But the concept is so cool, and it is being so well executed, and the graphics are so beautiful that I think Atlas is going to do well in the long run. Maybe not as good as Ark, but definitely really well. I wish there was a single player option where you could have like a mini set of islands to sail around. I think that would be ideal because the MMO thing is hard with live servers and a survival game. It's That's a tough thing to sell because you have to have time to sink into it. And a lot of people just don't have that time. So I think Atlas would do better if they found a way in the long run, to appeal to a player base that has more limited time. Um, like myself, because I usually play solo because I don't have a ton of time. Uh, Alpha Dux says, sorry, I have to dislike you killed a wolf. The wolf was going to kill me. It was self-defense. You saw he was snapping at me. It's not my fault. I like this pink rock. I'm going to kill it. I wish it would give me metal. I really do. I could super use some metal anytime now. It would be good. Uh, official Jabo, uh, I did not see your reasoning for liking the game. Sorry. I had to, like, look away from the chat for a minute. Um, grab some chamomile. I need, like, a couple of veggies. I need to keep my vitamin balances up. They're doing good. I'm going to head back towards the raft, guys, since I am probably going to end off the stream pretty soon here. And I would like to be in a safe spot before I do that. Let's go ahead and see if I can... There we go. We have a nice little firelight glow since it is strapped to our back here. That still makes me laugh. How are we not burning our hip on this torch? But whatever. Um, Mori33, hello and welcome. <laughs> Pepsigen says, bonus kite and change my mind. I can't change your mind because that's essentially what they, uh, what they call it here. <laughs> it's a chitinous material. Um, do I like Jurassic Park World? I love those movies. They are absolutely fantastic. Uh, I, yeah, 
They they are the reason I'm a scientist, and they're the reason I got into ARC in the first place. Um, Official Jabot says, Personally, it seems to me like people only hate the game because of the Rocky launch and because they want to fit in with the hate mob. I like the game because it's fun, and I got it free. Uh, those are good reasons to like it, for sure, um, that you got it for free. And really, the only reason I like it is because it's fun, honestly. It's... It's got a very different feel to it than ARC for me. Um, but I could see why people would hate it because it did get delayed a few times. It is super buggy. There's a lot of problems with it uh, in terms of people being able to do PvP actions on PvP on PvE servers. And, like, it's really easy to lose your stuff. It's really easy for your rafts to get killed. Like, if you're not on every second of every day, your stuff is going to disappear and you're going to have to start all over in terms of gathering, which is... That's quite the endeavor. So I can see why people would be upset um, about the game in general. But I think if you spent any amount of time, like, really playing it, if you spent, like, 10 hours trying to get into it, I think you would get into it. Uh, my water is dropping way down and the ground. Um, my water's dropping not too bad, but, yeah, that is definitely how you can get water. Uh, that is a way to do it. So if you lay down, you can actually dig for water. Whoops, I'm really bad at it. Whoops, I'm really bad at it. Sorry, guys. This is like the first time I've actually tried to dig for water. There we go. There we go. Whoops. All right. Well, I got some. I do have some water skins on me, and there is a river nearby, so I don't super need to dig for water, but um, I, I know how to. Uh, Futurist Sasuke, my day has been pretty good so far, actually. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been good. I've got, like, a lot of arc time, uh, well, not a lot of arc time. I've got a lot of Atlas time. I've had a little bit of arc mobile time this morning and, uh, been doing good overall. Had some puppy time. That was fun. Had some really good strong coffee, like death level caffeine. It's awesome that I got for Christmas. Very much love it. I might actually leave the raft out there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna check and make sure it doesn't need, doesn't need repaired. Oh, it does need repaired. Ugh, that's so annoying. I don't know why stuff keeps hitting it. I don't know how. I need wood. Uh, I'm gonna grab some wood. Okay, I have some wood. I'm going to repair my raft. I really don't want my raft to decay on me. Um, let's see. Jave says, scientist, what's your study? I actually study uh, experimental... Um, not experimental. I study evolution. That's what it is. So I do experiments on evolution and how that happens. And genomics. I also study how genomes evolve. It's a really cool field and uh, I super enjoy it. Um, let's see, Stormbreaker, hey, how's it going? <laughs> Alright, uh, which work do I do? Um, I'm a scientist, I do some online community forum work that kind of helps to pay bills, and then I'm also active on YouTube, which, uh, I do consider, like, a full-time job because I do put a lot of hours into it. Um, not a full-time, but, like, definitely a part-time job. I probably spend 20 to 30 hours on YouTube every week. It's, uh, it's pretty intensive in terms of commitment. How many Trank Arrows does it take to kill a level 10 Paris or an Arc? Um, a lot. I wouldn't use Trank Arrows. Uh, Stormbreaker says, what's going on? Uh, I was playing Atlas, and we are actually just about to end off here since, um, the stream has been going on for about three hours, guys, but thank you all so much for coming in and, uh, watching the stream today. And yeah, I guess that's going to do it for today's stream, guys. So I will catch you guys all in the next one. Signing off. This is the Iguana.